Okay, welcome, welcome everyone welcome. to the Max and King of Fundraiser <laughs> podcast. We've got some nice questions and some nice people with us today. If you want to all introduce yourselves. Kingu, you can go first. Uh, I'm Kingu. I'm ranked fourth in the UK. Play Jigglypuff. Um, Jiggly. <laughs> <laughs> moving on. Max. <laughs> yeah, Max, hey, oh, yeah. Max. I'm Max. I'm ranked third in the UK. I play mm. Sheik. <laughs> mm. Uh, I'm Aaron or Professor Pro. I'm rank one. I'll be rank one bro, forever. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> we need a new no podcast one. now. <laughs> <We'll> be, <laughs> no we'll one in this chat will, will overtake me, and uh, that's that's pretty much it. <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, and I'm I'm Frenzy, the uh, the podcast host here, number two, sadly, to this <laughs> little guy in the in the bottom right of my screen. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so we polled Twitter and we got some um, questions from the community. Um, just to raise some awareness about getting our two young prodigies here, Max and Kingu, over to Gommel 2022 in Canada. Um, so the first topic on the list is uh, Max and Kingu's origin stories. Um, so I guess, Kingu, if you want to go first and describe, you know, how you got into Smash and, um, and yeah. All right. So um, I've always been into Smash, you know, little kid on the Wii had Brawl, thought it was brilliant. I played Sonic. I loved Sonic, he was great. Uh, didn't like play it consistently for an ongoing period of time. Then, like, say fast forward a few years, I get Smash 4 on my 3DS, and I think that it's fucking amazing. Best game I've ever played. <laughs> and then I find out there's an online mode, and I play Full Glory because I think I, you know, I'm the big, I'm the real deal. And there's this one Smash 4 Sheik player called Dirty Dave. And Dirty <laughs> Dave is fucking crazy. You know, two-stocking me constantly. And I play Smash 4 Jigglypuff. And I think, right, Dirty Dave cannot be getting away with this. So I go on YouTube and I search up Smash 4 Jigglypuff guides. And the problem with that is that she's literally the worst character in that game. <laughs> yep. And so there's fucking nothing there. But what I do get is Hungrybox videos. And keep in mind, in Smash 4, you can rest someone at like 55, and it's like the shittest setup in the yeah, world. It's like forward air rest. <laughs> doesn't kill. I see Hungrybox up throw rest someone at 5% and it kills. And I think that's fucking amazing. <laughs> and so I want to do that. And so I don't have a GameCube controller. I don't have a GameCube adapter. I play on keyboard, I boot up Ampler's Ladder, and I don't know how netplay works, so before anyone on like the delay-based things, you had to have everyone join your room and then start it. I didn't know that. I thought they would just, you know, join in and it would treat it like they plugged in their controller. So I think my netplay is broken for three months because I keep starting it before anyone can join me. <laughs> and so I give up. I go back to Smash 4 3DS. And then Dirty Dave continues to fuck me up. He does not quit that game. He's the only person I get online because this is in 2019. Ultimate's already come out. And I end up going, right, I'll give this melee thing one last try. And I play with Ko, if anyone knows Ko, on Anthers Out of Friendlies. And, he's, yep. and he says this one little tidbit. Are you, are you pressing start before I join the room? And I go, yeah, I am. And that's the start of my melee career. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I didn't actually know that. <laughs> but how long ago was that, by the way? Um, that was September 2019. That's when I started. Uh, okay. I think I sent a message of like an at here in Among Us UK like in August or something. But I just couldn't play. I didn't know what was going on. <laughs> okay. Really so then what was uh, your first tournament after that then? Uh, it was Nang 4, uh, which was just before lockdown. Uh, I technically attended Merked, uh, yep. Merked 5, but I ended up having to DQ and leave before I got to play my pools. Mm -hmm. uh, That's unfortunate. I, played, I can't remember who it was. I played against someone secondary Ganondorf, and I played against Lorster for like 15 minutes before he went mm -hmm. on stage and played against Sechi's Pichu on stream. And that was a pretty big moment for me because... Lawster fucking three stocking me in Puff Peach Dreamland, and I'm like, wow, this guy's nuts. And then I see him 
Like, Sechi's just grinning, <laughs> thinks he's so funny. <laughs> Lost is trying his absolute fucking hardest, and I think... <laughs> I have no idea what the difference is between the levels of skill on these players. Mm. And that's what, like, got me in. Because it looked like he was so fast, and then he was into a PSU. <laughs> yeah, so then I guess the rest is history. You're definitely, like, really active during the uh, the netplay era. Like, we're sort of coming out of that now. But uh, I'm pretty sure you were in, like, every single bracket that you could find. <laughs> At least from what <laughs> I, I know. Have, yeah. I have something about, like, 250 tournaments entered. <laughs> Yeah, this is shit. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think that, I combined, that time period as well. I combined my Smash GG and the amount of challenge brackets I have, and it's like something a hundred mm. on challenge and like a hundred and seventy on Smash GG. <laughs> oh. In three years, that's oh, not even three years, right? Or is it? No, uh, I'm like, two like, like half, dead on two and a half. Yeah, yeah, that's crazy. That's yeah, literally that's, yeah. That's quite a lot of time. <laughs> a grinder. So uh, yeah, okay, that's. Was- Cool backstory. I did not know that, honestly. Like, yeah, it's surprising that you played Smash 4, like, that late into its, like, lifespan as well. Like, I just, uh, I, like, I think I'd watched some random video in my recommended about, like, competitive Smash. Hmm. And I thought, that's crazy. And so yeah. I wanted to try hard, and so I'd save my little Smash 3DS replays. <laughs> and I'd, like, yeah. check my habits, and I'd be like, alright, I keep rolling. I'm gonna stop <laughs> rolling. It's funny, because everyone is... Bracket plays old man as well, so you're like one of the young people that yeah. came over yeah. to Melee, which is kind of rare, I would say these yeah. days. So. Yeah, I mean, I remember um, my mom didn't believe I was able to get into Merc. She thought it would be like an adults thing, and so she yeah. DM'd Okamid on Facebook, and he responded, uh, "Yeah, but this is a M- Super Smash Bros. Melee event. Are you 100 percent sure he doesn't want to play on?" <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty funny. I found that quite funny. <laughs> yeah, awesome. Okay, well, I guess we'll uh, move on to the other young prodigy of the podcast, Max, down in the bottom Wait. left. My I, I don't really have a dirty day. So. <laughs> 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 uh, um, I, I don't have my guy. Uh, I think I, I was playing brawl like with the boys. You know, we, we were playing that play, and like I think this was in like twenty eighteen. Yeah, it, 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 it was like mid twenty eighteen. I think. Or something we were playing brawl anyway because that was again we were playing when we were kids right and then uh i think brawl has like it, it has like some history segment or it has like a little history section of the game or like mm-hmm. you can look through every nintendo title basically yeah that, that ever came and i i think one day we're just fucking about and then we look through that and i think M- M- melee was somewhere in there and we'd all heard of it beforehand but this kind of like r- reminded us or whatever like oh i, I know this one or it reminded <laughs> me anyway and then, I mean, I think one thing led to another, and then I, I ended up, like, getting us all the melee ISO, which we, you know, we ended up playing that. I'll say that on then, stream. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, we'll see. But yeah, we, we, we all like that. I mean, I, I definitely like that level from Brawl. And mm. I, I, def- I think most of my friends thought the same, or they were, like, too indifferent to really care. Like, it was all just Smash, right? Yeah. And then we, for, like, basically the whole of 2018, I, I was almost exclusively net playing with them. I like played with some randoms like a little bit towards the end, but it it it, it was all of them. But but yeah, no, I, I, but I originally was just playing melee overall. I was prepping for ultimate because uh, ultimate was coming out that year. Yeah, uh, that was gonna be the game I got, and I I, I ended up getting it. It was alright. I went to a, a tournament or two. I went to the lab like twice. Uh, it wasn't great. <laughs> <laughs> shots, yeah, shots. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I went to twice. I think Prop was actually at my first lab I went to. Oh, sick. Yeah, you, you, you were playing Ultimate Snake, I remember. <laughs> yeah, but I don't think it's my will against my will. I don't think you did very well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you didn't do great, but yeah. Uh, after like two, uh, that was it for me. I didn't go to any more Ultimate events. Because I, I, I think I just liked Melee more. So mm. I'd gotten accustomed to it over like the year. Yeah. And then I went. Off, didn't you start playing Osu a lot? But when you yeah. got really good at Osu. Oh, oh yeah. Well, I, I kind of quit. I quit Osu for Smash. Like, yeah. uh, like the, what that, that a was blunder. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I was like, what? Well, I think I was like five hundred ish in the world for that mm-hmm. game, which is like, which is it, 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 it was pretty good. Like, I think it's got like an active play base, for like a couple million players or whatever. Mm. So like, it, it, if anything, I, I still haven't like reached up to my OSU legacy in Smash yet, even though I'm probably 
somewhere on top 100 for Smash, it's still like uh, Osu was still a lot harder. Yeah, I, but... I was just about to ask, are you better in Osu or Smash? Uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm probably like p- percentage based, I'm better in Osu still. Okay. Or like I was better in Osu, just due to like the sheer amount of like, active players that play that game, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I think a lot of melee players take it more seriously though. Like I think yeah. a lot of Osu who just well, play for, like 20 minutes. Yeah, I, I think it's like it's hard to like gauge because I, I also yeah. think that Smash is like way more competitive but there are less players which is like kind of weird mm. to say like it's because it's, it's so old the the good players stuck around the grind out. yeah yeah like there's there's such like an established like meta or whatever but there i think there are way less of us playing there are others but yeah so i i quite obviously for smash i went through all that and then like three months after my first ultimate tournament i think it was like march 2019 I went to like that marked marked four hmm. marked f- one of them. Anyway, it was, it was on my first tournament. Uh, I think I got put in the pool with like Silas, Mo, a Mark called Graham. I kind of got messed up, but it it, it was fun. Like it, it was a fun tournament. I, I remember going last stock with Graham and Mo, and the, the, these guys were like first and second seed. I'm like, yeah, like if these guys are the first and second seed <laughs> like, of, the, of the whole pool. And I'm already going like like back then. I thought actual stock count meant something. But if I'm going for, if I'm going first, like last stop with these two, like surely it can't be that hard. Hmm. And then uh, yeah, and I I just kept on going to stuff. I went to like one tournament a month, more or less, for like the rest of the year. Got yeah. snubbed for the PR. <laughs> you didn't then, get snubbed, right? Yeah, I got like so really fucking hard. I, I, I remember. It. I got massively snubbed for the PR. Yeah. Oh, I I I don't know if you forget. I made a huge comeback on Chela. Um, in my first tournament as well. <laughs> you said, thank God he's forgotten. <laughs> um, um, yeah, no, no, no. Ch- Ch- Chela was my first, my first tournament win <laughs> of all time, which is nice. Let's go. Yeah. And uh, yeah, but yeah, I got stumped for the PR and then, <laughs> then, then COVID stopped me for the PR again. Yeah. And I, I didn't even get in 2020. But Bad times. I remember yeah. you made some emo uh, Naruto post about it. Would you? Yeah. Because <laughs> I think you were actually 26. Because they did like the yeah the, yeah yeah no I was you, you were one spot out of the PR <laughs> and like I, I remember thinking like did they really have to PR rush attack when he didn't go to a single UK tournament the whole season like oh you went to like internationals <laughs> yeah yeah he was only you went to like yeah. some Belgian bracket and, like, yeah really yeah. I, I was over I was over it hmm. yeah I, I I don't have a great I didn't have a nemesis or anything like that yeah. Dave said but 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 w- I which would you have preferred though because if you never got that you wouldn't have got the highest uh entering uh pr rank yeah. of all time i'm gonna be honest i would have preferred i would have preferred getting ranked in 2019 oh, really? okay 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 you i have think the highest entrance ever yeah i don't think i was ever gonna be broken like i yeah, think that's yeah, too high probably, probably yeah, I get ever again man. Yeah, i think i had a bit of a friend that i'd get pr <laughs> 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 yeah yeah i was like oh i'm gonna get like it was like close to i was like oh, i'm gonna get ranked i'm gonna get ranked in my first like year playing the game but like Top 25 in the country, like, there's no way. I'm like, that's definitely possible. And then he was right. I didn't get ranked, so. <laughs> I'm just another loser, I guess. <laughs> you are um, you were third. You, were, you ended up yeah. being third, so yeah. it's all worth it. Eventually. Your marked pool reminded me that my first pool had Bomboni, Aiken, and Modest Major as the top three seeds, and his top three gets out. That's, uh, <laughs> that's, crazy. that's actually pretty rough. Yeah. yeah, I know. I took a game off on Boney as well. <laughs> and then I got first off. Yeah, so you two, you two started at the same tournament then, pretty much then? Nah, oh, so like, yeah, like... He, he, King, King was at like the, the, the Merc six months after mine. Oh, uh, uh, okay, okay. Yeah. okay. So they all yeah. like blend together in my, <laughs> in my yeah, head, I'm yeah. not gonna lie. Yeah, I, I, King, you like went to his first one six months after me, I think. I, my first was in March. This was in like September. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Like, uh, yeah. like a bad stick bump. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I, 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 def- I definitely just start a little bit before him because I, I had that play in like 2018, right? Mm. Like, but I, I don't know. It's always hard to count like how much that really. Because e- even though that I did have game time, I still honestly think that like my whole like I don't think you get into like an actual mindset until you go to your first tournament to yeah. like actually improve and stuff. Uh, at least I didn't. It might be different now because of like Slippy and stuff, like the online tournament. But mm. like net play back then didn't really feel that serious. Yeah, I was going to point out for anybody new in chat, like this was before like the Slippy and all of the rollback netcode and like how sort of professional it's gotten now with online tournaments. 
um, you know, there, there wasn't really any online tournaments in Europe with delay based like the the version before. Slippy. Yeah, long live Netplay, man. That was all <laughs> yeah, well, well, we had we had like a weekly in the UK Discord that mm -hmm. I entered with my my ICs once or twice. Oh yeah, I forgot you used the yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> that, that was just a part of ICs. <laughs> wobbling. Yeah, I, I I wasn't like it, I, cause it, it was like it was like five months in. Like my sheik was definitely getting better, but like I just started playing ICs and I was I was seeing more success with them. Like I, I think I, I beat I got like a big win on Tanky at the time for me. That that was like, that was like my, my best you, win. And uh, I have been full stopped by that ICs and then never played it again. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, I got a big one on Tanky. I went like game three last stop with with Mordo Archie, and I, I like I beat Kidder in a one pound money match for my ICs. So, like, <laughs> at that point, I thought at that point I thought like, oh maybe my ICs are just my best character, but exactly. I stuck with Sheik and that uh, Oblik got banned so. What's what's the next question? Yeah, I know. I know we the have, we the have next a, one was about picking main characters, and I think King, you sort of like answered that already with this. Oh yeah, yeah King, you already answered that. So I guess, Max, if you want to go over like why uh, you know, why you went with Sheik, why why did I pick Sheik? Yeah, uh, I actually don't know because I, I originally started out with Jigglypuff as well. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, uh, I don't think you play jigs at all. <laughs> no, no, yeah, I I started playing well because. I, I, I'm kind of like really bad with inputs and like muscle memory stuff. What, 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 like so when when, when I picked up, yeah, yeah. <laughs> even though I play OC, like I, I'm actually awful at it. Like I think uh, melee was actually my first game like ever like playing properly with a controller. Mm. Like I, I obviously play. I think I, I I actually didn't have like an Xbox or PlayStation when I was a kid. Or a strictly PC growing up. So no, I I have like a Wii, right? But the Wii remote is like not really <laughs> like it, it's kind of not like anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah I hear that. So like, I I I wasn't used to the thumbstick at all. I and was then, uh, strictly PC since like, I was like nine. Yeah, wow. like, I, I didn't I didn't have any COD or any of that stuff. So. Mm. Uh, yeah, so the GameCube was my first stick. So I actually so what discouraged me from playing. A non puff characters. I all my friends could dash dance and I couldn't. <laughs> I, I, I would like I would try and dash dance and my finger would get worn out in like I, <laughs> no literally under ten <laughs> under ten seconds. Yeah, no, I, I um, have no thumb strength at all. So then I'm like, oh puff, <laughs> yeah, like puff doesn't need to dash dance. So <laughs> I, 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 I would just play puff like and cheese my friends with rats for like ages. And then uh, so at one point uh, I ended up playing chic like uh, it. it, it I, you know, I would kind of bounce around who I'd play, like based on because I I was like obsessed with watching all the tournaments, hmm. even in, in 2018 before I went to them. Like I, I would watch every major, like Gomu, Smash and Splash, blah blah blah. But I I, I think I, I probably just ended up seeing like Plop or someone play eventually, and I, I like the look of Sheik. I also I also think she's got like the coolest design, hmm. or like it's like her, but, like Sheik and Muff. Like I, I think they have like the coolest designs so far of all the characters. So I was always going to play one of those two. But yeah, I, I, I like alternate between like Sheik, Puff, Marth, mm -hmm. uh, until yeah, nice. I, 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 yeah, I sell on Sheik eventually, and then I, even when I went to my first tournament, I still like hadn't decided on maining Sheik, but I think I just ended up playing her for the pool, mm. and then it it went okay. Like as I said, I went lot, last stop with Graham and Mo. I got my big big win on Chela, so I think that was what decided it decided me to stick. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, that, that was okay, fair enough. Okay, awesome. So, next question is, uh, what was your breakthrough tournament weekly or moment? Um, so, I'll give Max a little bit of a, a rest of his voice and let Kingu uh, start with this one. That's a tough one, because <laughs> I actually just did the maths. Um, I entered 323 netplay tournaments. Jeez. Oh, netplay, so only netplay as well. <laughs> like, that's not even including yeah. like your land. <laughs> Yeah. You're like two probably have like, <laughs> like five or six LLLs for that. <laughs> yeah. Um, I think there was like, what was it during the BLM stuff? There was like a BLM charity tournament, mm -hmm. and everyone was sandbagging, but like there were some people who still went mains, and I just beat like, I think three PR maths in a row, <laughs> and like. I think that was the first time I'd like gone. I think I remember that actually. Mm. Yeah, I think yeah. it was like it was like Casper V Knuckles and someone else. I think Renzo, something like that. Mm. I took a game off Triff's Fox, <laughs> and I think that was the first like win I got. But I think the fact that I was always a net player at the start was it meant that like a breakout for me wasn't really a. Thing because mm. there was always like the shadow of can he do it on LAN 
Yeah. So I guess I would say the first LL back, because I think I did pretty well at that. I beat, like, Max and Yeah, I, yeah. I didn't beat Luz. You did pretty well at, um... The, the Nangwe beat, like, Tino. I feel like... Was that yeah, your yeah, first that... LAN, like, back? Oh, like... Uh, that was... No, there was the LLLs back. Yeah. Um, which happened, Nang happened, like, a couple months after. Mm -hmm. I think that was the first, like, non-weekly that I did. Yeah, that. yeah. Yeah, but I haven't sense. really had enough non weeklies <laughs> for me to do bad. Yeah. Um, okay, and you don't think there was any other, like, big moments for you outside of that? Uh, I mean, what's your best win today? Prof. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess against Prof and me, right? You like, do. So, yeah, yeah, okay, fair. Uh, I would say the first win I got on you... But like we both know how we feel. Yeah. Like that. That, <laughs> was it that like Leggy or something? Yeah. It was like 120 yeah. ping. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 It was like Chaos Six as well. Like some yeah. Yeah. Stuff. That was. Oh, I, I think my PC was just messed up. That, that's I then proceeded to like get rinsed by Time Muffin. Like it was not close. <laughs> I got salty. I think I called him a lame or something. <laughs> so, I don't think there's ever been like a breakthrough, but I think there's been like lots of mini breakthroughs. I mean, it, it makes sense with how many tournaments you've entered, like, what was it, 300? Yeah. Like, that might be more than I've entered, like, lifetime. <laughs> yeah. Like, uh, maybe not including weeklies, have, but... It's hard for me to have a big one that isn't, like, when I was already established and good, I got big mm -hmm. wins. Yeah. I just love chipping away at personal demons. Awesome. Okay, Max, what about you? I remember my Origin tournament. It was quarter 17, maybe. <laughs> or quarter 16 or 17, one of the two. Uh, Brand Speed had like binge watched the whole of Evangelion the day before, so like, and he, he hadn't slept at all, and it, he came to this tournament on what like on literally like zero sleep. Mm. I had it, I had it, I had him in my pool. I think it was like Sheik Marth, my perfect matchup. I remember I started FD, and he like looked at me, he gave me the goofiest look. Like, so, uh, <laughs> the, 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 that was my thing in 2019, or still now, kind of like uh, I would always take the Marth's FD because I still think that stage is actually broken for Sheik. That's mm. Marth, but. Yeah, uh, uh, so I would take all the maths to FD, and then, yeah, uh, I remember taking game one. I think for game two, Prof actually got out like his phone and started recording it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I see, yeah, I remember that now, actually. That was pretty epic. Yeah, yeah, I, bet, I, I, I mean, I like clutch game two, I get my first PR win on brand speed, I'm like, I'm, I'm, like, I'm hyped, I'm like, yeah, this is it. Like, I think it was like, I think it was like five months after my first tournament. I was, uh, was going to say, you so, were kind of high ranked then, right? Yeah, he was around. I think that he got fourteenth. Yeah, I was gonna say top fifteen. Yeah, sort of yeah, yeah. It was, it, it, that was like a super good win for you, it, it, Yeah, it, it was good. Yeah. Um, I, I was still pretty like again. I, I was still pretty new, so like, and uh, everyone was saying like, "Oh, my tag was melts back then." Yeah. I'm saying, oh, melts, <laughs> melts, melts the next up and color, the next up and color." <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah, like, and I, I, I remember I, I was like, "Yeah, but maybe I'm getting good," and then I lost a tanky in bracket straight after. So. <laughs> <laughs> you crushed your dreams. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I, I played tanky. He reversed free over me with Sheik. <laughs> I went up to O versus Marth and he picked Sheik and reversed free over me. That's the most. That's so tanky. <laughs> yeah, I like, so, you still do that now. Yeah, I was. I was still pretty bad, but uh, after I beat Brandon, like that. That was because I think I had like this idea in my mind built up, like oh, like the PR is way way better than everyone. Like be a non rank player like me, mm. but then like when I. I was like, oh wait, these guys kind of suck too. <laughs> and then, and then, yeah, yeah, you realize that there's the the, the PRs kind of split up into divisions in the way. Yeah, I, I, like, <laughs> like, uh, yeah, like, cause back then, like, when you're bad, like, even I couldn't really tell the difference between like, I mean, I kind of could, I knew there was a difference, but I couldn't see it as much between someone like you and Brandon, right? Yeah, like, you do, not, like it's harder to if, tell. Yeah, like, oh, you know I mean, if you're if you're if you're getting like three, four stop. Yeah, by everyone, three, yeah. Three, yeah. Like, it's not I'm, really, like, that uh, much of a big difference. I'm like, oh, rank one and, like, 14, like, that's not... That's I, remember find, I remember the first time I found playing Archie harder than playing against Frenzy. I seen the fucking <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but then, like, when I got better, I'm like, oh, wait, there is a pretty big gap. Yeah, that, that was, I guess, because the call was my first kind of break, but I guess my first, like, like, breakout after I got good was probably, like... In, maybe a, a, HF Lamb was probably my like first like European mm. breakout or like a, oh a, you were first three yeah we were watching in the bomb bit we were watching the bomb bit yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
You're uh, up in the skies. Uh, <laughs> it was super kind of over crazy. as well. Yeah, yeah no, no, no. But, super but, duper. Yeah, it, it, <laughs> it, 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 <laughs> I don't even think it was... It, it was like the least close reverse fury of all time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, like I remember flicking the mental switch. Like oh, I'm just gonna start Ted chasing him, and like I actually hate it when you do that because yeah. I can see the switch get flicked. Yeah, that's, yeah. That's like... when you become a top player is when you have that switch and you yeah, flick yeah, it, it, and like it, that's just the mark. <laughs> it, it, it is it's true, but like I don't I don't flick it very often. Yeah, I, actually, no, I remember me and Max did like three fox sheep best of fives. I like lost the first one three one, take the second one three two, and I'm like, do you want to do a decider? And like, and Max was like, oh, this is a decider. Okay, I'll try. And he starts fucking. <laughs> Pivot tech chasing me. <laughs> and I, I, I went zero to ninety, and I, I was, I couldn't believe it. That, it's kind of yeah, because I, I definitely do have like I think I have two, I, I've like I mean a lot more so than other players. I have like two modes when I play. It's just like, but like one of them is just like campy and tech chasey, <laughs> and it's kind of like it's kind of long. But if I, so if, long. If, if I need to try win, if I need to win. Yeah. Play lane one game. <laughs> oh, yeah, <I'll> do it. <laughs> That's my motto. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. number four, most emotional moments: a win and a loss. So that's for for you two, Max Kingu again. So I guess Kingu can start if you have an idea in mind. Um, I'm kind of curious of yours, Elliot, as well. Actually, I want to know what yours. Are we doing everyone's then? We, we, we can do everyone. Let's see everyone. Let's see everyone. I want to hear everyone's. I need to think about mine then. Yeah, I thought about mine already. Yeah, but this is definitely a good question for everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think okay. So I think there's two contenders on my most emotional win. Uh, the first one was the first time I beat Modest Major. Uh, long live netplay. Um, because I think I was unironically. Like it was a it was a GG stranger looking record. It was like seventeen and zero, and that was just like the first time I felt like I'd break I'd broken a big hurdle. Yeah. Uh, the second one was beating Nick class with Fox. I had never been happier in my life <laughs> because this was during the time when he was taking sets off Frenzy. He was beating like Meedy. <laughs> it was like it, he looked top ten in EU. Yeah. And the last time we had played. It had been like three one, and the only game I took was a timeout on Battlefield, and then I got like three stocked in two minutes because I got pilled. <laughs> and then the next time I play, I ran forward and repeatedly up smashed, and it was just fucking easy, <laughs> and it felt amazing. It was the first <laughs> time I'd ever felt like I cheated. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it, was it was the time I played a spacey that I cheated, uh, and it felt amazing. Yeah. But what, what's and, your worst loss in that? I'll need a moment to think about that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. All right, I mean, we can do wins first if you want, and then come back to losses. Yeah, I, I know my good. loss. I know my loss and my win, so I can say okay, both. Okay, well, Max, have I, you got a win in mind or a win? Yeah. Damn it. Oh. I mean, Aaron can go first if you need time because I need time I, to think I, about mine. Yeah. I, I, my worst loss at, it was when we when I was at Apex. It's the same Apex where uh, they did the money match, you know, left and that one. I think it was 2014, and I had a Luigi in my pool. And, and at this point, I I hated Luigi so much. <laughs> I hated this guy and I didn't want to play it. I think his name was Ruffle, and uh, and I and I beat him. It was like pretty bad. And then Cactua was in our pool, and then he he just he looked he walked up to Cactua. And then I was really sorry of my loss. And then he walked up to Cactuar and he was like, I just beat this fox. I don't know who he is. <laughs> and that's the way he said it, it was so dismissive. That, and I already hated the matchup that I was like, I, mentally, I was like completely done for, for like the whole trip. Damn. I was like so salty. Just, and it was just something about the way he said it. It was like, <laughs> it, was so dis- it was so dismissive. And like, oh, I just beat this like random scrub. And... Oh. And there was something about it that just like tilted me so much. The best time I was thinking about that. I don't. I don't have one that was like that like sticks out loads. But uh, I think one of my favorite times was, was actually kind of recent when I beat when I had to beat S two J to to get number one. Because if I didn't beat S, yeah, this, I remember this. I remember to this. To beat S two J, because this is when it was like if uh, Sechi was gonna be number one. Yeah. And uh, I forgot what the tournament was called, but Schism, uh, right? Let's go to or Dreamhack. Yeah, Dream. Yeah. No, it was Dreamhack. Yeah, yeah Dreamhack. Dreamhack. Oh, okay. And at this point, Setchi was definitely going to be number one. If I <laughs> and in my mind, I was like, I literally 
have to be no. SDJ. This is such like a roadblock, yeah. And then I like free won him, and I played like so fucking good. <laughs> and, then I, and I popped. I was like, let's fucking go. And then I just fucked uh, Sechi. It. And then I got free owed by Zane in Grand Finals. Yeah, I got fucked. Yeah. But uh, that's probably my best moment, just because uh, it was like it, before I went to the set, I was like, oh, I have to be SDJ. It's like it's gonna be so fucking hard. But uh, I don't think I don't think my wins stick out as much as my like losses. But uh, that's just me. But yeah, those are my uh, two probably wins and losses that I can remember. Those are good ones. I think I've I've got I've got a win and loss now. Actually, I've got one. I think my my best win was like when I beat uh, Archie Mordo for the first time. Like not the bees. I remember because at that time, like uh, I, I mean, to be honest, I, I actually don't really get like very emotional at all. Well, like after wins and losses, <laughs> I, I I think I think I'm like by far one of the least like intimate people I know. But at this point, most like uh, Mordo, I was like, I think my record with him was literally like 0 and 13. Um, but this was 0 and 13 in like an eight month period as well. Like, <laughs> yeah. so, so I mean, we played a lot of sets, and I would just lose every single one. And then I won like the first time I got a win, it was like to get second at like a regional, like not the Bs or whatever. So it, it, it was like a, it was a really good win. I, I was pleased with it. And then my, my worst loss was like, I think it was a few months after I was playing like Fat Tito in like yeah. Losers Apes or something of a tournament and I, I was, was up nine? yeah was it was nine, nine. Yeah, it was oh, nine yeah yeah nine. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nine. and I, I I was up like three stocks to one on the fourth game I was up like really heavy and then I like I like edge guarded him I like I did like a run off fair yeah. But I like tried. To, I like tried to needle cancel turn around to get to ledge to like save like a few frames. So I was like, uh, instead of just not being, because if you do that, then you can get like a quicker needle charge or whatever. But then like I, I like messed up my needle cancel. I think I added up to the zero, and then like he just <laughs> yeah, and and then it was like yeah, and, it, and he just won. But it's fine. I still had game five at this point. But then in my mind, I'm like, all right, like FD was going good. Like if I didn't SD a zero, like very likely I'm winning that game. So instead of taking him to battlefield, I, I went to FD again. <laughs> like get game five. That, like that. that was such a salt run back. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was like the most yeah. salty like troll run back of all time. And then like uh, I think game five was still mad close. So it was still like game five, like last hit, but I ended up losing. And I'm like, damn it! Like why didn't I just go to battlefield? And then it, <laughs> it, I I didn't really mind like in the in the moment. I, I I never really get too salty like straight after a loss or a win. But it was like a few, a few hours after I was, I was kind of like annoyed. I was like, oh, I there was just, there was one time me. there was one time you lost to me and you you were like pretty sorry and I, and I felt it felt weird because I've never seen you so. Uh, <laughs> right, yeah. I think it was like a boiling point point where you were just like, I don't want to lose to you anymore. <laughs> and I was like, I've never seen you like that and it felt yeah. so weird. I was like, I'm, no, I'm just I, used to you like kind of accepting it. I, like, I, 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 again, yeah, well, no, I'll t- I'm like I'm not joking when like I almost never get salty when I lost and wins, but this was like I think it was like last December. Yeah. That, that there had been like four, four, five, tw- like I, I, I literally, so I went to like a myth. I lost to like, or like I went to something. I lost to like YouTube frenzy prof for like, you know, I got third. Like, what do you do? <laughs> and then like fucking, I, I went to France and I lost to YouTube to get like seven. And I, it's just happening again. And then, yeah. and then I went to this tour. I went to this tournament again. And then like it, it was like a, a short pair. And like uh, this is in couple, but like. I, like I usually, I don't sleep for tournaments like that much, but I generally haven't slept at all for this one. So like, th- there was no way I was ever gonna play well. So like, I I, I had no expectations going into it, and yeah. I played you both, and I think I got, I got like actually destroyed by both. Like, it, was, it was like the <laughs> yeah. worst I'd lost to you both. And I was like, oh my, like it, it, it was just it was just annoying. Like it, it yeah, just I hear that. I hear that. Like it, it was like it was like a few tournaments. I'm like, okay, like how how long was it gonna go on for? <laughs> like, I like finally like I collected my free win at Myth. Like I achieved, like, I, got, I got my first one finally. Didn't even, like... hit. You didn't do a single reaction tech chase, and that's <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> just all that yeah, smashes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I only I, I, figured I, out at the end. Yeah, I, I, th- I think I checked back. I'm like, oh, like, like that was the thing because that that's the most telling thing for playing you two. It's like I, I don't even like I feel fine, but I. I get reversaled like for so much every time yeah, it's yeah. spaces and like <laughs> you two both just hit it so hard that I'd like lose my whole stock when I was one. Yeah. So it's so annoying. <laughs> but, yeah, uh, uh, but I wouldn't say that was that, that I, I wasn't really saying that that was like an emotional moment. Yeah, it was just kind of like 
a little short term like salt i guess yeah, yeah it was just the first time i've seen it for me anyway but yeah 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 no because uh y- y- usually like again like uh, i'm not exaggerating like I, I really don't i don't take losses or wins that much like yeah. e- even when i beat elliot or, like myth or whatever like i wouldn't even like <laughs> you didn't even pop up i didn't really pop off like i'm just like okay like i, I- i've known i could win for a while now, yeah like, yeah i mean I'm, i feel like we've both known it because we've just played that much that, yeah like, yeah but, i'm but, always but, like yeah he's probably gonna win at some point you know yeah um, i i like knew i was gonna win at some point but i mean, i probably could have been a little happier because I, I won at like a big tournament like that yeah. that was good I, I i probably won at like the worst time for you for me to win at to be honest <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah when you're literally competing for like first in the country <laughs> and i just thought i cheese my win on you but yeah uh, that, Wait, can't be first if i'm getting cheese can i <laughs> yeah apparently not hey, elliot what's yours then what's yours uh i guess so i think like Winning, it's between either winning that Nango over you, like the historic one. Uh, that that was pretty sick. I can't. That was yeah, yeah. Because I was just like, <laughs> for those who don't know, uh, Prof hadn't lost a tournament to a UK player for I think it was eight years, or yeah. something like that. It was like <laughs> it, it was something like that. Anyway, it was some crazy long streak, and like obviously I'd been going to every tournament and losing to Aaron for like the past <laughs> four years, and so yeah, that was pretty historic. And then the other one actually was. Um, Winning Valhalla doubles with Min. Because um, we made, like... Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, because yeah. we'd, like, practice dubs a lot. And we made a reverse 3-0 on um, Triff and his teammate. And then, obviously, we won two sets versus you guys and Grands. And, mm. yeah, it was just, like... I don't know, like, winning in doubles is, like, so much better when you're, like, really good friends with the other person. It is I feel really like, good, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, there's just that team element or whatever. Mm. But, um... And then I'd say the loss is probably... Uh, after losing in the same finale, just because like I'd worked a whole year to like Wait. get oh, to a summit spot. Oh, <laughs> the online, the on, the, yeah, the online yeah. one. Oh, because I, okay, I, I okay, stopped okay. playing for like a month after that because I was like, I just can't do it anymore. Yeah. <laughs> but I uh, it would have been yeah. something back in your ultra salt days when you. Used no, to I, I was going to say like during the the, <laughs> the the classic like missing dare versus you, but like I was only salty for like. 30 minutes after that or something okay okay and then okay. whereas this one like i went to hf line after and i was like i don't want to be playing smash yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, i just want to yeah, break the, the same circuit was actually so troll like <laughs> you're just playing for like nine months so yeah, it boils, yeah. It, it boils down to one i never thought about that if like... squeak just comes and yoinks both sports <laughs> like... yeah, yeah. <laughs> but uh yeah no i'd say that's my most like emotional just because it, it, it wasn't like in one go it was just like long like i had to yeah, sit with yeah. the salt <laughs> yeah for like yeah. so long you know but uh, well, you're not you're not emotional after that one as well for us and we lost the pitch week no, I wasn't actually. Because no, cool. he didn't was care like, about the spot, and he entered like none of the events. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, was, I wasn't like I was just like, oh well, I'm like. I feel yeah. like I feel I feel like I mean, obviously, you didn't care before that point, but like you're put in a position to win a summit spot, like. Yeah, uh, no, no, but, but honestly, I can I can say like up there, it's nowhere near up there with me being salty. Like I was actually <laughs> not that salty because yeah. because. Yeah, it, as Elliot said, in my mind, I would I barely entered any of the events. Yeah, and then I, I was know. just like, oh well, let me just enter in at the end, and then I needed <laughs> it, and I wanted to get it, but I was just like, oh fuck, like I, yeah. I was just like the normal kind of I lost the tournament. Yeah, that, that guy's got nothing on the Luigi player. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, the Luigi that, that and I was sorry because of that because it was like one of the so it's like when I first started traveling, so I really yeah. like wanted to prove myself, so yeah. that's why I was more sorry about that. Oh, actually, it's pretty funny. Like you just go and some random Luigi's like, who's this guy? Like yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you, well, hopefully you guys won't get that this time. But I think yeah, well, I had a similar kidding. experience when I first travelled. But I think you guys are a lot better than than we were when we first yeah, yeah. travelled. So. Yeah, I mean, I think Europe's just probably a lot better than yeah. we were back then, right? Yeah. Like, we've got way more competition, so you've had bad bad practice. <laughs> awesome. Right. So what's, what's the next question? I think the, yeah, I think uh, we've got through everyone, right? Or yeah, yeah, that's it, that's it. Yeah. So the next right, one, number six. No, 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 number five, number five. We're, no, we're starting. Number five. Yeah, we're doing number five. <laughs> so <laughs> we're starting the salty, the salty portion yeah, of the these podcast. Are the salty, these are... <laughs> so, for everyone, where would the Green Goblin be ranked on the current UK PR? And I actually want the chat to answer this as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, chat participation is, is more than welcome here. You can post any good results that the Green Goblin has. <laughs> I'm actually not fully aware of your results. Obviously, I watched the uh, the last fundraiser stream where you got a famous win against um, a certain player in this podcast. Yeah. <laughs> but tro- like, tro- trolling aside, I actually probably think I'll be ranked below Kingu. 
Like that, like I wouldn't be ranked above King Yu. Like, there's no one, I, but I think I'll be ranked below. Right? I think you would get ranked between sixth and ninth, sixth and tenth, probably. I played uh, Luan and I beat him. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. So then it would, ju- it would just be if wait, who's number? Who's the he, ones above that? It's like, it's like, it's like Mordo, like. Uh, <laughs> Okamage, strange. Oh, what's that sign? Nah, nah, I'm pretty sure I'll be six. I'm pretty sure I'll be six. No, 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 lie. no, no. Wait, no. wait, wait, wait. More, I'm just good. Yeah, who's, who's fifth? You think, this, you think that this Samus just like can't take a Randy loss here and there? I swear, I lost to a Zelda. That was a pretty. Yeah, 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 but the, yeah, like... yeah, yeah. No, no. no the, the, the reason why, like, the reason that the reason why I said I, I think you'd be put like what. I, I think you'd be between like sixth and tenth, because yeah, I think there's yeah, a ch- yeah. I think there's a chance you'd lose to like like yeah. get, like there's definitely a chance you lose, there's a chance you lose Samus Game and Watch like to squeeze you. There's like you yeah, 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 yeah. I, I'll give you that one. I'll give you that one. Yeah, yeah. Take some Randy losses. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, you know, I, I I think I think between sixth and tenth is a fair bet, depending on the brackets that you got that season. Yeah. Yeah. If somebody could link the PR in the uh, the chat just to help everyone yeah. out, that would be useful. By the way, the next the next question coming up is my favorite question. Yeah, wait, <laughs> <laughs> do, 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 do you guys all... most interesting question that, that I'm really interested to see what everyone's yeah. opinion is. Wait, do you guys all think sixth for tenth as well? Though? Um, uh, yeah. I need to just check but, who's fifth quickly. The thing, no, I, I don't, don't think I'll be tenth. I don't think fifth, I'll be tenth. Fifth, fifth is Tino, and I, 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 I like. I, I think Tino. Uh, no, no, I'm not. I think, I think, I think Tino's gonna be just. Uh, I mean, no, 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 I wouldn't be. I, okay, I, I'm okay, not. Okay, I okay. like. I'm not gonna be cocky and just say like. It's like you're overestimating how much you won't get upset. Yeah. Yeah. I think. Really, you play, you play ninth. against Scox. I think ninth. You're getting fucking. There's there's a world where you either three o Scox or Scox three o you. There's no in between. Why is that look in your face? Uh, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. It. No, 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 no. I, I, thinking, I, I, I definitely think. I definitely think it's um, pretty good. But it's it, top I, ten. Hundred percent top ten. I, I think there are too many weird match. Like, like I, I think. I think if you had to play Nebs, like what would yeah, happen? I was most, thinking. Like, what, what would happen most like Luigi? I think I'll be Nebs. Well, I, I, but the the fact that I said I think means that it's already yeah. yeah. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. 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 you were like, no. I'm pretty sure you got humbled yeah. by like our twenty three Luigi in that Netplay tournament we hosted that one time. Yeah, I think I'm like. <laughs> or like at least equal to so uh, okay. yeah, I, I don't know I, I think I think you've got too many matchups to be a consistent number six like okay. too many women I'll give you that for now for All now right. for All now right. Well, you, you, before you already can segue, well, where do you think my secondaries would get ranked? Uh, the, your secondaries are bad. They're they're terrible. <laughs> <laughs> uh, which character? Give me a character. Oh, fo- f- Fox and Marv. Fox and Marv. Fox and, and Marv. Yeah, well, that, that okay, but bear in mind, my math. Uh, bear in mind, this season, my math has like a, a winning record on twenty three and Mordo, no, who are both no, top no, ten, no, 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 who yeah, are both top ten. Yeah, but that's your your your, your, your spacey your spacey cheesing. Your spacey doesn't count. Spacey cheesing. Wait, uh, okay, okay. Well, my fox, and, my fox and Marth, They've also beat. They've beat now. You wouldn't be okay. Okay, let me. You wouldn't be ranked above Bomboni. You would, uh, 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 would not be ranked above. I, 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 I do not. I do not think they would. My, I, I think you would. I'm gonna remember my, my, my Fox Frio Bomboni last time we played. It beat GG last time we played. That's number. That's number twelve. Oh, why are you guys losing to me? I'm gonna have to think about that one, innit? I think I. I'd say top fifteen for free, but. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about for free. I don't know. About I, 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 I was thinking potentially even top ten, but I don't know. Yeah. I think top fifteen. Yeah, I yeah. give you top fifteen for now. For now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, now, I, I, I know you're anxious for the next. <laughs> it becomes the most interesting question. But... Wait, what's this question? Okay. The players that we're ranking. Wait, have wait, have wait, you got wait, a list wait. or not? Nah, I'm asking more. I, well, I, it's, it's the most interesting for me. Wait, what, what's the question? Um, really the, the top 11 UK players of all time. Yeah, so Aaron, if you want to describe this one, because okay, you're the mastermind okay, behind this. Basically, Mike, I, I came up with a question. I was like, if all of these players were still active in the UK, where would they be ranked? And it's it's basically uh, it's basically just a list of all of the 11 players of the UK who have proved themselves in some form or just like separated themselves from the rest of the UK. And uh, we basically had a list of 11 players and, and all of us individually had to rank all 11 of them. 
I'll so, put it in the chat and uh, yeah. I'll scroll down and to myself. We're, we're basically, we've all done our list already. No, we haven't seen each other's list at all. We've been avoiding it. And we're going to read out our list and then we're going to. Uh, Elliot's going to put it. Elliot's going to put it on an Excel and then the chat has to rate which list they think is the best list. So remember, if if these players were still if these players were still active enough to play, uh, to be on the PR, where do you think they would be? Uh-huh. And it's eleven players. And oh, yeah. yeah, can you read out the eleven players? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm yeah. just making yeah. sure I've randomized because yeah, I copied well, it from my list. So wait, yeah, we, we've all done our list, right? Yeah, we've, we've all I, done our I, list. I, I, I have my list. I have my list. Yeah, I've got the, my list there right here. Fraudulent claims in the chat good? before, before, uh, but I, from from a certain from a certain Kingu, but I haven't seen his list yet. <laughs> So I'm interested to see what his list is. <laughs> don't tell me, don't tell me what it is. Man. There was a few claims made in the chat when we were talking about this, and I was like, hmm, we'll see, we'll see. People so, are shit. I don't know what we made. Right. So I've just right. posted in the chat what the uh, the eleven players are. Right, so those are the eleven. But just for yeah, if anyone can't see the chat, it's Frenzy, Mint, Maxi, Fuzziness, Professor Pro, Isdar, VA, Max, Factino, Sechi, Kingu, and you. Wait. Is it? Wait, did you yeah, put... yeah, that's yeah, Maxi, you did do Maxi, yeah. So all of those 11 players, yeah, ranked in an order. <laughs> wow, no AD. No, no AD, no, no AD, no AD. <laughs> no AD, unfortunately. Yeah. But, uh, all right, who's, who's going to go first? Who's going to go first? Uh, you want me to start? Uh, I'll start, start if you want. Okay, okay, okay. Let me see. Start okay. from the bottom. Who, I need to... Uh, oh, you want me to start from the bottom? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you have to start from the bottom. Who's last? Who's last? Mm. It's a self. Uh, you, you, you making me? You making me doubt my list so now? <laughs> Who do you think is the worst? <laughs> Who do you think is the it? worst of it. these eleven players? <laughs> All right, let me get up the the sheets quickly, just so I okay. can uh, write it down. Uh, but uh, chat, what do you think of this list? I think I think this list is pretty fair for everyone. Who's I don't think like, there's anybody that we've missed. Like, yeah, I, that's what I'm saying. I don't think there's anyone that. AD, no, 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 no. I, I love AD. I love AD, but he, he never, he never like, uh, he never like proved himself like in that kind of way. If AD is on the list, like, no offense, he'd probably so be people. at the bottom. He would be, at, uh, yeah, he, he, he would probably be just be at the bottom of everyone's list because I, I don't think he's better than anyone who's last on that list. Like, who, if, like, if you, if you guys think AD's worth putting on there, who would you put? at the bottom of the list and then like who would be above AD or who would AD be above on that list anyway, I'll start mine anyway whilst, whilst yeah. chat is arguing with themselves <laughs> <laughs> alright so my number okay. 11 is Tino okay 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 <laughs> I'm waiting for the reactions <laughs> okay, on each okay. of these okay okay, okay, no. okay. I think num- oh. number 10 is Fuzzy which I thought yeah. might cause a bit of salt if he's watching the yeah, stream. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think number nine is VA. Okay. Uh, number eight is... He's like... <laughs> number eight is this star. Uh, seven is Max. Six is Kingu. Uh, five mm. is Maxi. Four is Min. Three is Sechi. I'm second and Prof's first. But you have Maxi as fifth. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You have Maxi as fifth. You, you two are right next to each other, to be fair. Okay, oh, okay, okay. No, that, that, that makes it worse. That's like <laughs> <a good power. laughs> All right, let me uh, let me try and screen share this on the stream as quickly so I can okay. fill this in. I've got. I've I mean, just, I've I've just there wasn't much outrage at that list, so I'm pretty pleased with that. Okay, okay, okay. I've just assembled my list in my head. Right I'm, now. Gonna have to, I'm gonna have to say my list here, and I'm gonna I'm gonna have to describe why I put like. Yeah, I was gonna say list. if you want me to explain well, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have to describe why I put. You, you, I mean, you could do yours if you if there's anyone you want to explain in there. Like um, why 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 is Tino last? I have to know why is Tino last on your list. I think it was between uh, Tino and Fuzzy, but I just feel like. I think like Tino's peak. I think his peak win was like Pip in twenty nineteen, right? Yeah, but it's either Pip or me. Off. I I but I thought T- so. Didn't T- was it? Didn't Tino have like a good record of you in twenty nineteen? I think we were even. But, at yeah, yeah, like, yeah, like yeah, yeah. You, you guys but, were even over. Like, you like guys his... were even over like eight sets, and like I, I feel like if you gave Fuzzy that same chance in twenty nineteen, I I wouldn't have I wouldn't have expected him to replicate that. No. 
But I also feel like Fuzzy would have done better in some other matchups. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. Yeah, he probably would have. He's never head to head. Head to head. That's one thing. Like you can't, you can't just look at how he would have yeah. done first friendly. But uh, I, I'm, I'm down to do my le- next list. Uh, yeah. Let me just point out as well. Uh, so the reason I put Mint so high as well um, is because I think he has a really good matchup against all the people below him. Wait, 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 where did you put him? You put him first. I right? put him fourth. Wait, so j- just, just, to like, she, wait. just to confirm, is this list like how good we think they are right now? No, if no, they, they, they were to still be playing, if they never quit, if they like, yeah, never yeah, quit yeah, the game. Or if they, they just did enough to be on the PR every hmm. every season, basically. It's not if they, it's not if they super okay. grind it out. It's if they were, if they were still playing enough to just like be quali- to qualify for the PR in the season, where do you think these players would rank? Okay. Which means they would have to be semi like active, like at least they wouldn't be lost. Yeah, because I I think it's hard. I also think it's kind of hard because because like I mean I'll do a little baby spoiler. I had V8 at the bottom of mine, but that's because to my knowledge he hasn't played the game in like okay okay in literally four years, right? But I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, it's, okay, people want me to share at the end. So, okay, yeah, I think what, if, if everybody says everybody. theirs, and then I'll type all of it in. We can then, just do it at the end. We do it at the end. We do it. Yeah. All right. All right I, I'm going to have to explain. I'm going to have to explain my last place here. So. All right. Yeah, I mean, yeah, Aaron, you go next then. Okay, okay, okay. I, my, my last place is Maxi. And I'm going to wow. have to explain why I have Maxi at last place. I think if Maxi was still playing, Maxi would still be t- tilting. And Maxi is the ultimate tiller, <laughs> and that's my and and I d- honestly like I think overall that Maxi would have ended up having a losing record against the majority of the players. That's why I put him at last because I think I think if when I look at the rest of the list and I think of their ability, I I don't see him overall coming out on top. I think he might get some wins against people like Isdar and maybe Max, but then after that, I think he would like struggle like a lot so that's my reasoning for putting uh maxi last fuzzy fuzzy is 10 because uh because <laughs> he's forever switching character and he like he he basically doesn't excel in one character because he's always switching every time he loses fat tito is number nine and this is this is the part <laughs> where i have at eight i have max i have max Seventh, I have Isdar. Six, I have VA. I actually, I played VA recently, and I honestly think if he was still playing, he would still be, he would still be up there. So yes, uh, mm. six is VA. Fifth is Kingu. Fourth is Mint. Yeah, third Sechi. Second Frenzy, and then me. I'm first. So can, I even he <laughs> says I even put as first. Don't be silly. You know who goes here. <laughs> As first, so that that is my list. That what a shit list. That's an amazing <laughs> list. What are you doing? I, I, I can't. I, I need to hear your list. Let me type that in. Hang on. So first do you, do you, do you, uh, I can't believe you have Maxi at last place. Yeah, I, 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 kind of crazy. Crazy. I, I think I think Maxi would have done the worst out of, out of all of the players. Wait, wait, like, wait, wait. So you have think... it's everyone versus everyone, and, and I think Maxi would have came out on on, on bottom. So, because well, yeah, I, I generally haven't played. Yeah, I, I generally haven't played VA, so I have no idea how good he is. But like, you think yeah, if he came, you think if he came back right now, like he'd actually like. W- 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 where do you think he'd get ranked if he came back right uh, now? He'll be above Isdar. I think he might. I think I think he might struggle against both of you two, but uh, at the starting point. But I think he would honestly like catch up to me. I, I feel like the problem with VA is like all of the a lot of the matchups in like the top. Like, however, now it would be really bad for Yeah, him. I think, like, Peach Sheik and That's why I had him lower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peach Puff's not great, or Peach Fox. I mean, but I also, really I also think VA would have a pretty good time against a lot of the top section of the UK. That's just me, though. Maybe that's my legacy bias. Uh, <laughs> like, uh, <laughs> maybe. Um, I, I, honestly think, I honestly think he's really good. And I think the kid. fact that you've got Maxi last and then VA like <laughs> wait wait wait, wait did, where do we have VA like seven? I still think Maxi would struggle yeah. the most against versus yeah, yeah yeah I think the fact you have Maxi last and VA sixth is kind of insane yeah that is I I, I don't think it's Maxi was second in the okay. UK I remember <laughs> yeah yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, think, but this is this is still me rate, rate. This is me ranking it about how I think he would do versus everyone on this list, and I still think he would come out on the bottom. There's two jigglypuffs in this list, man. Mm. Are you putting the peach thick? Yeah, but I still think VA would handle it. 
That's just me, yeah. though. So no, I can tell you, I have played that guy as far. Uh, it's not great. <laughs> Also, what's your list, King? All right, yeah. All right, yeah. All right. So, last I have fuzziness. Uh, and yeah, when well, I have, guys. Mm, uh, last I have Maxi. After that, then I have Isto. Then I have VA. Then I have Tino. Then I have Max. Then I have me. Then I have Mint. Then I have Frenzy. Then I have Sechi, then I have... Okay, Pepper. okay, okay. <laughs> that, that's a, that's yeah. what... I remember you were talking in the chat, yeah, I remember you were trying to say that Sechi would be above me. I was like... Hang on, oh, uh, so what, what was I after like... me? It was Prof, Sechi, <laughs> Frenzy... Mint, me, Max. Right, okay. But Sechi second? Yeah. Wait, so, okay, well, so if this is supposed to be a list of, like, how well people would do in this 11-person head-to-head, I think it doesn't make much sense. If they kept playing. Yeah, even if they kept playing, uh, I don't know, because because uh, I, I think Frenzy and Prof have like kind of equalised the record now. They're like fifty fifth, like so. But 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 back on Frenzy, that Sechi never stopped. Yeah, even if even if Sechi never stopped, like Sechi Sechi still had like a pretty bad record versus Prof. Like yeah, it, it, yeah. I, I think I, people I, don't realise how bad his record. Yeah, I, I I don't think he, yeah. yeah it, I do. It, it, it was like a yeah, bad record, and and then like he was like I think Sechi and Frenzy were like even as well. So like, yeah, but that was at that time. Was Frenzy was also getting fucking shit on by Prof at that time. <laughs> yeah, I, no, I, but I was winning tournaments over him, though. I, I definitely have a way better record. Like, I, had a, well, like, I think I was losing head-to-head, but I think it was because he had the wins on, like, Triff. Got it. Well, then there you go. We've got VA in this list, and apparently VA is six. So that's a big win. Yeah, <laughs> allegedly. Yeah, yeah I, I think I think uh, I'll read I'll read my list out, but my criteria is a little different. Like I I kind of assumed that like if everyone came back right now and played an active active tournament season, I made my list based on where I think everyone would get placed for that season. If that's what okay. happened. Do you before? Do you think your uh, do you think your list would change a lot based on my question? Yeah, I think it would change yeah. a fair bit. I mean, you I can mean, we we can talk through these three and like you can make a new one if you want. Quickly. Yeah, we'll, do a few bit of rearranging quickly. I'll try. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll try and get this working on the stream then. Yeah, but um, my, my like list based on that, like I had uh, I, I had VA last. Uh, I had Tino second last. Uh, I had Fuzzy after that, and then I had Maxi. Then I had uh, Istar. Then I had me. Then I had Kingu, and then I had. Uh, I think I, I had Sechi, then I had Mint, then I had Frenzy, then I had Prof. Which was my list beforehand. But I think I'd make some changes. So if if it was assumed, like you said before, I think I'd change to put... Uh, I think I'd have Sechi at third instead of Mint. I'd have Mint at fourth. And then... Yeah, and then assume, assuming we all kept up playing and stuff and we, we, we all never quit, I, I think I'd probably have... I, I'd have Maxi around fifth, I'd say. Uh, and then who, after, after Maxi, probably, pr- probably still Kingu. Uh, and then and then me after Kingu. Uh, put yeah, I'd put his star at seventh. It's funny that everybody has um, Kingu above you, even though you're higher on the, <laughs> the PR. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, I'm I'm just envisioning. I mean, uh, I don't I don't know. I think it's because he done better. Well, Kingu's beating both of us, right? So, yeah. like, yeah. You know, I, yeah. On paper, I mean, so. I mean, I mean, actually, I don't know. Look, look, looking at the pool of these players, like to, to be fair, I, I I did beat Sechi at Camp Cone that one time. To be fair, Arrest so, Sechi, Arrest. Uh, I, I did beat <laughs> Sechi that one time. But, uh, yeah, let, let's see. Uh, I almost want to drop Min. Yeah, I feel like I'm giving Min a lot of benefit of the doubt because he shit on me when I was worse. No, nah, Min. I think Min is still. It's a pretty good. Wait, yeah, I think Mint won't be up there in a thing with two puffs, a peach, a chic. I can't a lie. Falcon. I just... <laughs> okay, I I put I put VA below a star. I think. It's sad that uh, we never got to see much Sechi Mint sets to be honest. Mm. Yeah, I put VA below a star, yeah. and then I put Tino, then I put Fuzzy. Mm. I think I think that'll be my list. Yeah. Yeah. It's funny because I feel like there's certain sections that are really in line, like there and like 
here other than proc button VA. Oh, wait, yeah. Miles <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then there's some that are like way like massive distribution. Like Max, I think Maxi's probably the one with the biggest variance yeah. on like what people think. But other than that, I, I feel like we're pretty in line. There's too many like good people against Puff in this list. And I feel like I don't want to say Maxi cheesed, but. <laughs> Yeah, so you had Maxi at lot second last as well, right? Yeah. Well, you have him at second last. Yeah, I mean, me and Max both have So, yeah, we... Yeah. Maybe I'm just... I mean, I, again, I, I've, like, not even... I've not played, like, a third of this list, so... I'm not going to yeah, know like, that. Do you think Maxi beats any of Prof, Sechi, Frenzy, Mint, me, or you? I mean, right now, pr- probably not, but, like, th- this is also... Yeah, but uh, that, that's the thing. That's why I have Maxi... If, if really people kept like, playing... Like, yeah, yeah, I, I, I had Maxi super low down originally, but like, if number two in the UK kept up playing for the whole time for like four years, he would have probably improved alongside everyone else. I'm assuming. Yeah. So. I think he would have yeah. definitely got wins on me, um, Max. Uh, he'd probably take a set against Mint eventually, right? Like they play that much. That <laughs> he's taking a set. Uh, I think Prof put me below his stars. Kind of, kind of weird. Kind of weird. That was fucked up. But I think I, I I think it's because you know I mean I mean I mean Prof just Prof just overrated King and Star because they're playing then, broken no, no. Bro- broken matchups for sports. King <laughs> is not really fucking good. As you I, mean, I, I, like, I, I, uh, he just chokes a lot. Not in tournament. Yeah, not in tournament. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I actually think he's really good in it, but not uh, just he has a bit of an underwhelming. But I think if we if we were playing like if all of us were playing each other like a lot, I think I would still probably put him above you slightly. But maybe that would change because you have a goon wave now. You never know. <laughs> yeah, you, 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 haven't, you haven't seen me. On, you haven't seen me on the goon wave. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I think Istar like Istar might have a slight better matchup into you, maybe. Yeah, yeah, I would say. But so, yeah. I think I've got a better matchup into Frenzy and him as well. Uh, I don't know, Elliot. What do you think? Uh, I don't it's know, not I mean, taking sense for me. Like, I, I know the yeah. last few have been pretty like. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I'm, just, but... I'm just going based off your last like. like it, it, uh, I assumed your last few sets of him haven't really been close. No, no. Right. But he's definitely, like, given me trouble in the past. Like, yeah, I wouldn't yeah. say it's, like... A, it it I isn't, mean, I, like, yeah. I think the last, t- the last time he's beaten both of you, it was at that Mang, wasn't it? Like, in, like, 2019, yeah. ages ago? He, he beat both of you one yeah, time? It, it, yeah, that was way long I, ago. I just, like, struggle to see anyone on this list besides, like, Mint and Prof, who is solid do better in June than Max. Yeah, I don't think I don't think he does better into the puffs. I don't think he does better into a VA. I don't think he does. Uh, better well, into we the haven't seen them play yet, to be honest. Yeah, but just like going off what I what I've seen from his salt, I feel like he's running. Into yeah, I, I I I don't think he does better into Sechi either. Yeah, I can't lie. I, I, I think I think yeah, that's I actually true. Like, it's not it's not Sechi was when when they were close, actually yeah. at their like. Well, was it? It, it was kind of close. It was kind of yeah. close. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I'm talking right, like now, because like, like Istar didn't just like stand still, stop playing, like the rest of these guys. Like he, he kind of kept up a little bit. Yeah, like, yeah. He, ent- he entered online stuff and all that. But like, I get, uh, yeah, yeah. Did Istar ever take a step from Sechi? I think they did a weekly. Yeah, I don't think he ever beat him at like a big tournament. Yeah, so yeah. Yeah, I, 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 I'd say like yeah, I'd, I'd say it's Istar pro. Istar probably does better into prof. Because you know, Sheik Fox is just borderline unwinnable. But like, <laughs> uh, apart from that, I'd, I'd, I'd say I've got a pretty clear case for confirmed seven for six. Like, that's that's kind of fucked up. Right, well, is it short? Is it short for time? Is it short? For- yeah, actually, yeah, also, okay. I, I, I put myself below Kingu. You know, to be polite, you know, I'm, I'm I can't polite. put myself above. But like, you guys are supposed to stand up for me here, like. Hey right, guys, uh, yeah, we're gonna do straw I'll poll, and, up, yeah. and the chat has to vote on what they think is the best. Uh, what do you think is the best? Uh, List. Also, there's been a, there's been a few donations that you should probably read out. About. Yeah, I can do that while we're getting the results for. Um, what about donations? This. Oh yeah, we're, we're over a thousand now. Nice, nice. Um, I, uh, I can do it if you want. Yeah, yeah, I'll set this up and post it in the chat. Uh, right, Kingu Kingu's Nan donate <laughs> donates one hundred, saying good luck. Uh, Birdneck twenty pounds says melee chimps UK SSBM gaming one hundred pound. Thank you so much, Goon. SSBM, go get him in Canada, buddy. Respectfully, and ten pound. So nice. Yeah, yeah just remember if you, if any amount chimps? any amount helps pretty much. Yeah, so. who is chimps? All right, we're gonna give it until twenty five past. So five minutes. 
And guys, you can't vote on your on. own. You can't. You can't. Don't cheat in it. Don't oh, cheat. I already voted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone voted. Right. 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 No, right. Unless you think right. somebody has a better list. <laughs> yeah. All right, everyone vote. Everyone vote on their own. I, I'm, I'm confident saying that I don't think my list is the best. I think if you think you have the best list, I think you're brain dead because yeah. something like this is so like. <laughs> It, 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 it's, it's so insanely volatile to measure something like, like there's no way you can know there's no, literally no, no, no way <laughs> the, public, the public always knows the public we'll see we'll see who comes out on top this uh, is so fucking bad there's zero way alright but I guess we'll, we can quickly do the next question while we wait and we can come back to this yeah. problem maybe well, what, what, what's the question after this uh, the next question is what do competing mean to you in general what does competing mean? I think this is one of the Twitter questions, right? I think we're on to the yeah, yeah, Twitter yeah. questions section. Twitter questions. Uh, yeah, I was I was thinking about this. Like like uh I think I think it just means pretty much competing means nothing if you if you can't lose. Basically being able to lose is is what makes competing important. Because I was speaking to someone the other day and uh they were like they're not entering tournaments because uh they're afraid to lose and i'm like but that's literally what tour- like if you can't lose at a tournament it's not worth competing at. it's going to be the most boring tournament so in kind of essence like you being able to lose is what makes competing worth it because it makes the win worth it because you know you know what was on the other side of the table like potentially so like being able to lose is a huge part of what makes competing like valuable and and like coming above that potential loss so i would say like a huge part of it is just being able to lose and then coming out on top which is a bit weird to say but... Good answer. So having having adversity yeah <laughs> having 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 something to break through i'm trying to think okay i think my answer to this question might be like the worst one of all for like in my in my mind, competing for me is seeing it's like how good it's basically seeing if I can play how good I know I can. Like I, I, I'm, I kind of every time like I, I, I'm very rarely thinking about like the player versus player matchup. Like uh, whenever I'm playing something, I'm, I'm already thinking about the other guy that much. I'm just thinking like I, I always tell myself. I mean, because I, I I do genuinely believe this. If I play as well as I know I can, I'll probably beat like the vast majority of people I've played. Which I think is true, but mm. I, I, like so, I, I'm, I'm just like thinking, alright, but if, if I, I'm just testing myself to see how often I can like I can live up to my potential, I guess, when I'm playing. Like, like every time when I play a set, like when I lose, I'm like, okay, I just didn't play as well as I could have, or like whenever like I win, I'm like, okay, I, I played well enough. Like I'm, I'm not really thinking about this guy was better than me, this guy was worse than me, or this guy's just a better player. Because hmm. I mean, even though it might be true, like it, it's just like uh, I think it's yeah. I just always tell myself if I play as well as I I could, then I'll, I'll, I'll basically win every set. But, yeah, I, I consider sleeping more than one hour a night. No. <laughs> yeah, basically, it's just your. It's very like a uh, self-driven. Performance. Yeah, yeah. I I, I basically uh, I'm only really playing to like just see if I can consistently play it well enough. I can. Okay. But that's not really going to happen. And to sleep more than an hour a night, probably. Probably still hour if that's what you want. Uh, I think for me, it's having the opportunity to have something that I can completely invest in and see, like, the most tangible results of probably any other field that I could be in. Because a lot of fields, like, outside of games, they're, like, they're either so big that, you know, you're always going to be a drop in a pond and it has to be very you know, inherent motivation, or it's going to be, like, something that's, you know, academic or, you know, like, a something that isn't very personal to you. But I think, for me, a lot of, not just Melee, but, like, games in general are an opportunity for me to, like, be able to fully engross myself in something that doesn't have an end goal outside of proving myself to myself and to all the other people who care about it just Mm. you know the raw getting good at something rather than having a a tag attached to it Mm. yeah that's cool that makes sense yeah yeah um i'd say for me it's it's just more about like the uh 
the journey and having something like really big to aspire to you know because it feels like a lot of other things in in life there's not really this like big overarching like goal and i sort of like that with competing there's like you know the the top of the mountain or whatever and you know i i enjoy the climb <laughs> so yeah. but um i keep falling off the mountain though every time i run into this guy <laughs> in the bottom right there but I just <laughs> Chief says I just want to be an anime MC. That is true. <laughs> that is true. Yeah. You are ultra grinder as well. Like I am, yeah. So I know. I just like that part about the game, though. Like, yeah. it, like, like King was saying, it's sort of like you can you can sort of see the the progress, whereas it's yeah. like kind of hard to in other things. Um. Yeah. So, so I think everyone else that nice, nice, nice. Do you mean for to quickly yeah. looking back at the poll, Prof? Paul somehow uh, yeah, I think... he's got an, cause he's got an army yes. of cr- an army of cronies. Everyone know what the, everyone knew the truth. And then yes. frenzy, um, me and King you were like tired. This Wait, did me one more. You have like the most similar list. <laughs> yeah, that... yeah. And then frenzy's had the worst. <sighs> God, what, what, what did he even? Yo, King you. See, I think I think the only you? the only bit I regret was the Maxi one. I think you've convinced me a little bit, but I think you overranked Maxi like an insane amount. I told you, I think Maxi would perform the worst against every. Like, I don't know. remember this is a UK PR, so it's not about how how he how he's doing versus. I, I put Maxi pretty high too, but like I, I can't. Think, yeah, but I, I mean, he could he if he was to return and then just like beat everyone, then uh, yeah, yeah, like he could easily just come back. But I, I, th- I mean, t- to picture, I think he did lose to Luan at the last tournament he went to. Yeah, yeah, but um, yeah. but I meant uh, friends. Yeah. like Sergi lost to you, so like if he's not like at that, active, yeah, yeah, like yeah, I don't yeah. count it like too much. Yeah, to be fair, fair on his side. Yeah, it's but all right. I'll uh, I'll hold the L on this one, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the next question. Do you think, I think VA is very underrated, but that's just that's just me. Yeah, well, we'll see. Maybe we can, maybe you can do some convincing. I mean, he, he, yeah. he, he signed up to Athena. So. Yeah. Oh, is he? Yeah, 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 but I, yeah, I don't, I don't know if he's gonna end or not. I don't know if he's like I, I was speaking to Silas about, it and he said that like he's made it very clear that there's like quite a small chance he comes. He just signed yeah, up to yeah. like. I think he messaged me about it as well. So if he, he signed up if he wanted to come, I think I think it'd be cool if he did. I, I mean, I I really I really wanted like another I want another good player. Yeah, yeah. Play, yeah. Did, I doubt he he's, he's been playing too long. I'm like I'm like very doubtful that like some people when they've like reached their peak and like not like peak in terms of like. They like get to a certain age, and it's like they're probably not coming back. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I've met, I don't think I've met anyone who's actually like gotten to as like above thirty, and then they're just and then they stop playing, and then they randomly just come back. <laughs> like most yeah. people just uh, are like pretty much done. Well, cause so. that's the I think like because genuinely, I mean, this might be a little bit of bias for me, but I think the UK is like actually cherry picked to make me not improve it again. Like, okay, okay, I'm playing Sheik in this game, like, and I'm literally against, like, I'm against Spacey's and a Puff, like, that, 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 that's my practice, it's kind of, like, okay, Fal- okay. F- F- Falco's, like, the only, like, but my character literally has, like, Marth, like, Peach, like, every low to it. Oh, and, okay, okay, like, I see what you mean. Like, like, yeah, like, like, yeah, like, these are all, like, amazing matchups for me, like, my character. These are all really good matchups. Yeah. But, like, uh, all my practice is... Is anyone watching our top ten? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I mean, like, the actual good people. I mean, they're, 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 they're kind of messed up. But, yeah, but, but again, uh, I, I, I want, like, a, yeah, I, I want a good, I want a good, good thing. We get rid of the fucking spaces. Good play. Yeah. <laughs> I, I want a really good play. All right, all right, all right. What's the next question? Yeah, okay, next question. Is, what does competing mean? Oh, wait, no, how do you no, no. stay yeah. active slash competitive while feelings of burnout? Uh, I don't know. I, I kind of just play other games like League. <laughs> so, yeah. So, uh, right, yeah. My answer is like, uh, I don't think I'm very good at that at all. <laughs> I was, <laughs> but but I, I must say, wait, before, before you answer, before, like, when I first started playing Smash, I'd never had a problem with burnout because I was like so obsessive. Like, I would, I would always go to someone called Spook's house, which was like someone who did Smash Fest back in the day. I would, I would constantly grind, and I never had a problem with burnout because mm. I, I wanted to play. I always wanted to play, and that's that's how I started off. But uh, so I don't know if you like need to be like that at the beginning. But when I was like that at the beginning, when I first started. Uh, I I never experienced burnout because I just always wanted to play, so I was like super obsessive. But and then uh, now when I'm like feeling a bit burnout, I just 
play other games like it's it's not really that com- like if if I, it, it's not really complicated if i felt if i feel burnt out i just don't play the game and i just do other things <laughs> so yeah <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I can provide my input because I felt pretty burnt out recently after the same circuit because like, obviously I entered everything and literally all I did was just stop playing for a month, uh, played Rocket League for a bit, <laughs> and now I'm more motivated than ever to play. So I think sometimes it is just like give yourself a break of some time. I think there is some stuff to do with like your motivation and your goals. Like if you have two lofty goals, like your only goal is I want to be the absolute best, like you're going to run into burnout, right? Because you've not got yeah. that, that measuring stick. But I think if you set good goals, I think it's actually pretty hard to burn out. I play Fox. <laughs> well, you play Fox <laughs> you when you burn both, out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm playing Fox for a bit. Okay. I'm playing Fox for a time of my life. Yeah. I think, I think someone, said re- but someone said recently that uh, apparently playing jigs against like mediocre bad people is really boring. Is that true? The shittest experience. I <laughs> I, I, <laughs> I have not played up unranked in like. <laughs> I, I guess that's because of her it, playstyle. It, it, it definitely makes sense. Like, yeah. Character was like not the strongest I, of punish games. The punish game is either like a two hit combo that insta kills them at ten percent, which they all <laughs> run into, or it's shit. <laughs> and there's no in between. Yeah, I can. I guess every, all the bad players just like try and chump check you, or they try and camp you, and they're bad at it, and they just get yeah. hit. By the two <laughs> hit that kills them at ten. There's like nothing you get out of it. You either camp and you win, or you cheese and you win. And it's like <laughs> yeah. you don't get to practice anything. There's yeah, just, I hear that. I hear that. There's no fun. I I guess we I guess because uh, Puff is like there's so many like micro defensive situations that you need to practice that that a bad player would never give you that. So you can't even like practice your combo game to make up for their them no, being bad because you're just you're just, just resting them and then it's just like <laughs> that's it. <laughs> But, there's there's like nothing to get out of it at all yeah. and it's fucking annoying i just yeah, that's why that. i wouldn't play secondaries otherwise if i could just play good people all the time i probably wouldn't have a secondary besides fox but yeah that's like some iron iron mentality it's really mm-hmm. <laughs> that's good stuff yeah. I, I don't think i have burnout at all to be honest well, like, kind of, uh, like... You have, I've, I've, you have sleepy out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, mean, like, yes, I, mean, I mean, like, because that's the thing. Uh, but it's kind of hard to define burnout. Like, how, how do I stay competitive, like, well, well, I'm burnt out? Like, I think with, like, my whole, like, approach to the game, like, it, it'll just be, like, when I don't want to play the game, I, I just won't. But that's, yeah. like, that's kind of for yeah. the most part how I, like, I, I just I, I don't really try like I don't try force it so it doesn't make much sense for it but. yeah I think I think the question though might be implying that if if you're someone who wants to improve but you're feeling burnout, oh, if you're like, what do you do? To. But then I just think you still need to take I breaks. Think, right? yeah, yeah, take breaks so. I, I, I still think you come back. Yeah, to breaks, exactly. Yeah. I, I, I think taking breaks is always the best. Best yeah. way. I think there is there is a degree to it where like you need to learn how to build, like, a mental stamina for it. Mm-hmm. Because, like, uh, improving takes a lot of conscious, like, effort. You know, you can't just kind of play the game and, you know, just get better. You need to, like, think about the things that are happening. And if you're just, you know, stopping every time you kind of, you know, start feeling tired or being like, oh, you know, this is kind of effort, you're just kind of going to continue to do that over and over again without yeah. having any time to kind of cement mm-hmm. the things you're thinking about. So I think to a degree you do kind of need to push through it mm. because otherwise you'll just get yourself in like an improvement loop where you don't really do anything and you just keep you yeah. know, thinking, oh, I'm going to care for me and then just nothing happens. Yeah, there, there's you been... Also, like, you don't want to take uh, it too far. There have been times when I've been like really tired and i made myself play because I want to improve on me playing when I know I'm playing bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because a lot of people be like, I'm playing bad, I'm stopping playing. I'm stop, yeah. But, but I, if you play when you're bad, when you know you're playing bad and get better at playing bad, it, it's also a skill in itself because yeah. you know you won't always be playing good. But uh, that's it, it depends on loads of variables, like how you're feeling at the moment, if you feel you can handle it. But uh, yeah, I, I think that's a pretty good exercise tool when you know you're playing bad consciously realize that you're playing bad and use it as an opportunity to get better while playing bad and if, if you're yeah. like mentally burnt out sometimes you just might need to take a break it depends on how long you've been playing because if you're playing like 20 minutes and you're mentally burnt out <laughs> and then then your smash just might not be for you <laughs> yeah. So. yeah i think it's important to define the difference between like 
burnout and laziness, which can be pretty hard sometimes, mm. but it's important to work on that. And just as a quick side note, Archie was asking, is burnout physical or mental? I'd say it's mainly mental, but then it mm. can manifest itself physically, I think would be the best way. Yeah, I think, I'd like, it, when I'm when I'm burning out, like, physically, I, I normally just need to stop playing because my hands are tired. But then mm-hmm. I've been, to get to that point, I've been playing for hours. So I, yeah. I, I just do need to take a break. So. I don't think I've ever had, like, hand pain unless I've literally been playing for, like, the whole day. Yeah, and I mean, and your hands, like, shouldn't be moving like for that long for like seven hours anyway so you yeah, should, be taking, yeah. you should yeah. be taking a break at that point so yeah I, I don't think i have a better answer than to just like whenever there whenever there's been like a tournament or something that, like i haven't want to go to uh like it, unless it's like a really big one and i it, i'm lucky because it, it hasn't really happened for a big one like but i think it's happened for like the the smaller ones like mm. i think I, I i just don't go usually mm. like uh i think that was one in bournemouth the start that I, I just didn't really go yeah and that was one in southampton this year as well i just didn't go to so i just wasn't feeling it but yeah um i, I, I think that's that's i think that's the best i think that i do generally think that's the best advice yeah i think it's the, the, the simple uh, advice is like, pretty much is the best you, you, you take the only advice. conflict comes in if you're someone who just wants to improve and you feel mentally burned out at yeah. the same time then you're kind of stuck in a rut but yeah yeah okay cool all yeah. right so next question have you ever played one match of the mix you extremely salty and how did you overcome it? If you even did, Lul. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, I, I can start with this one because I think everybody knows my uh, hated matchup. It's Moth, right? No. Wait, what is I, it? I hate Young Link. <laughs> oh, really? That's my matchup that I hate, okay. yeah. That's the oh, one matchup I just... It's my most hated character in the game, I okay, think. Okay. Um, I... But I'd say I've had matches before like that um where i've been really sorry and i think it always comes down to just not understanding the character well enough at least in in my experience that's what the problem's always been for me and then once you actually understand it's like you can see why why you're actually losing like you can actually rationalize it rather than you know oh this character's lame <laughs> i wouldn't have expected <laughs> young link i was like so sure yeah. you would say more <laughs> <but yeah. laughs> no, if it was if it wasn't young like it would be ices probably Okay, yeah. wobbling ICs though. Yeah, wobbling ICs. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. not because uh, that's not a thing. Like, yeah. Yeah. Um, Interesting. Uh... So I think I have a pretty easy answer. Pigs. Oh, okay. <laughs> why are they pigs? I fucking love. That's why my favorite match. Right? <laughs> okay, okay. I um, thought you might pay that one, but yeah, Karen. I thought you said uh, fox, but <laughs> if I hated fox, I wouldn't be here. <laughs> um, <laughs> and the way I overcame it. As I played Fox against Peach instead. <laughs> you did I, beat Foul, didn't you? You beat Foul. Yeah, yeah, I've beaten yeah, Shaw. Yeah. I've, I think I've beaten everyone except Tria. Okay. Fox. My Fox is good. Ooh. Don't make that face. Please tell me if you play Triff that you're going to play Peach. <laughs> um, Jinx. Yeah, Fox you're is not, not the one beat, for that. <laughs> you're not going to beat Triff with Fox, I'm sorry. Not anytime soon, are you? <laughs> Challenge of okay. um, <laughs> so I think there's a better order. <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> You're not being true. Uh, right, maybe, I, wait, right, I maybe I'm wrong. Correct. Maybe I've never seen you. I'll be very, 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 <laughs> very shocked if you beat Triff when he's playing like even at thirty percent with thirty uh, percent. Wow, even at thirty percent with Fox. Cool, and All best right. of five set. I'd be yeah. very shocked. I'd be very shocked. Yeah, yeah. Right, I get the point, man. You'd be surprised. I've been, I've been very vocal about <laughs> the fact that King is fucking trash. Very clear, clear to you, <laughs> and, yeah. and and very clear. No, I know, I know. Yeah, yeah. cool guys. Whatever. Maybe you, maybe yeah. you'll do it eventually, but you're not doing it. Maybe now. eventually, you know. I'm just kind of. I'd <laughs> say three. I'd <laughs> say two and a half years <laughs> minimum. Two and a half years minimum. <laughs> you don't want to be saying that. What's going on? I'm not gonna make any opportunities, you know. Yeah, sorry, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm gonna get a peach. I'm gonna play. I'm sorry. I'm gonna play <laughs> I push. I push Kingu's buttons. I'm, <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at a tier list right now, trying to find my trying to find my bad matchup. I would, would I you think... actually would you actually only go Fox versus Triff though? <laughs> I think Triff is the one person I would go Puff into. Okay, because okay. I know he fucking hates it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. that that is what. No, I know it's not like. I Isn't know he's good versus Fox, and I know he's like, he, not the he best. He goes Fox team. versus Puff, right? He went Fox no, versus Solo. No, no, no. He, 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 he went Fox versus Solo battle last time they played in tournament, and he no, won. Last time he went Falco. Oh, what? Well, oh, he he won. Won. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, I, I think that was a Falco tournament, though. Like, he yeah. Falco yeah, but the hot. Fox is shit. Yeah, yeah, but his last, like, Peach tournament, 
he went Fox there too. He won that. I, I just remember yeah, in yeah. 2019 they did loads of like Fox Peach when they were, those guys are playing a lot. Uh, not Fox Peach, Fox Puff. Sorry, like Valhalla mm. and um, all those tournaments around that. But I don't think they actually yeah. played that much over the online like era. Yeah, they had one or two sets. Yeah. But um, I think on the overcoming salt thing, I think a lot of people talk about like picking up different characters as like. You know, if you want to get better faster, it's a strictly negative thing. But I think a much more important factor than, like, the raw understanding of your character is how motivated it makes you and, like, the way it manifests in your mentality. And I think that if there is a matchup, like, you know, I think for a lot of sheep players, it's like Ice Climbers, for example. There's a matchup that you hate that fucking much and, you know, you play it and it's lame and it's hard and you have no fun and, you know, if you lose, you're going to be sad. If there's one of those matchups for you, just pick up a different character. Like if it make being happy while playing is like so much more important than any of the fucking numbers about, you know, are these people they solo mained and they got this good? Like it, there's there's no there's no point in trying to you know bang your head against a wall when you don't want to bang your head against that wall, and it would be easier to play someone else. It's mm. like pe- people talk about it like you know. You just don't understand the matchup. Nah, sometimes the matchup is just fucking lame. <laughs> you know, there's not that much going yeah. on with it. It's just dead. Damn, maybe just I should be up. picking up Chico or Falcon then. <laughs> you should. I've been saying this for ages. No, don't, don't do no, that. That's fine. I think, uh, yeah, I'm uh, interested in what Aaron's is. That's not Luigi <laughs> now. <laughs> <laughs> it was Luigi at kind of one point, but the thing, I don't know. Who the Luigi? I feel like you don't like Peach, but no, no, no. I kind of like Peach. Uh, yeah. No, I don't mind it. I don't mind it. Uh, I'm... It was Falco at one point. It's got to be Fox, surely. Is it not Fox? No, 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 no. But that, that's not not something I've been extreme. I would never like extremely salty over Fox. Uh, over Fox Tales. But uh, I mean, it's one of my weaker matchups. But if I'm thinking about like throughout the history of me playing the game, like, uh, hmm. I never, I never really liked Falco that much when I was like getting better at the game. Just, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't really have like a really, really clear. I have, I have loads of little salty moments where I've like hated Luigi. I've hated Falco. <laughs> I've, but I, I don't know if I've had like a very like clear one. Hmm. But I think I would lean it towards. Uh, I'd probably lean it towards Falco, but. It's not by like a big a big margin by any of the other ones. I'm, and how I overcame it, I just practiced it. It's not, it's, yeah. I just grinded it a lot. There's no other way like around it, pretty much. But uh, I think it's because I play Fox. I, like most of the time when I like because I can just dict- dictate the pace. So it's hard. It's hard for uh, yeah. You can't really be so. Yeah, it's hard for it's hard for me to like hate a matchup because. It's hard for me to like just get completely yeah. overwhelmed by another uh, character. So yeah, that's I don't really have like a clear answer. That's pretty much it. Good answer. What's like, yours, Max? Then? Uh, I don't really have one. Like, but I, I if I had to pick one, it would be ICs. But I've, I've never had to really play. Like, I, I, I've never had to play an ICs good enough to actually. Yeah. Like, I, 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 I've played like I think I mean I, I think Johnny fights like the best ICs. Europe by like a fair bit. Yeah. I've, 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 I've played him a bunch and it's fine. I just think it's like, I, I don't get so, like, I, I just think it's the flaw of the character, like, it, um, in the matchup specifically, like, it, it's kind of just like really bad EV to like make aggressive plays with Sheik, Sheik mm. ICs. So, I mean, uh, it, it doesn't really tilt me. I'm, I'm mm. fine playing, I'm fine like playing defensively and like, I mean, I, I don't. I, I usually still like play aggressively. I, I lose for it, or I, I like I take bad trades for it. But I, I, it doesn't tilt me. Like I, I, I know I know whenever I mess up, like in the matchup, it's just me being like making a bad play. Like if if I want to play like more forward, I should pick Fox or something, which <laughs> yeah. I which I have done to be fair. Yeah. So yeah, it, 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 I don't think it tilts me. at all really. Yeah, I think that's my answer. Makes sense. I mean, from how you like play the game and like how I feel like you're probably the least emotional like person yeah, yeah, yeah. in this call so uh, it makes I, sense I, that I you get the least cool. tilted uh, by like yeah. a matchup okay cool so the next one is who is the next UK up and coming player 
top five contender. I, I, I think this. I think this answer is like really, really clear. I think we're all saying Luan for. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I was thinking Unfor- Luan. Unfortunately, what a box player will be. It'll end up. Yeah, it's definitely enter. gonna be a box. Fucking box. I think. I think like <laughs> fucking box. I think Luan's yeah. pretty good. Oh, I mean. I need to see the PR again. It's gonna be Luan. It, 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 I would be very shocked if it's someone else, but. I think Ty's gone pretty good in the short amount of time too. Yeah. He, he, he give like, uh, like Ty literally did come out of nowhere. Like he, 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 like I think he he went to his first tournament in 2020, and then like he's like he got ranked 19th for his first season, which is pretty, which is like pretty fast as well. I think the thing that would hold Luan back is just because he lives in Ireland, so like it's harder yeah. to attend stuff compared to yeah, Ty. Yeah, yeah. But he's being um, more he's being more active than Min at least. So yeah, I feel like he's attending stuff. So but yeah, I feel like all the other people on the PR from my guitar at least, like other than maybe what like mm. Chief Ty, Luan, are all Chief- people that have been around for a while. She's kind of been around for a fair bit too, to be fair. But wait, 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 wait. Did, yeah, but he was, he was in the north, if, I feel like. So if, yeah, if, maybe. If Min, wait, wait, wait. So if Min and Izzar were active, though, who, then who would be the next? Who, so then like who top, would be top five? By, by top five, I see it more as like you're in that tier. Like, yeah, yeah. You know, I, mean, like, yeah, like, like I was just thinking but... because if you because because if it was uh, me, what me, you, uh, Izzar, Min, then the top five would be between. Oh wait, no, Isdar. Wait, Isdar would be might probably be below you too. But then the top five would be a bit more, you know, be a bit more yeah. shaky. Yeah. So, but I mean, I get, I get the overall question, but I think everyone thinks Luan will enter that bracket regardless. Yeah, I mean, my answer will be like either Ty Luan or I mean, it depends how. Up I, and, yeah, I, I think I, I, I feel like a lot of you are probably gonna sleep on Ty. But okay, he, okay. He's, he's been playing for like an insanely short amount of time. Mm. Like, I, I haven't played him much, so, but yeah, no, no, no it's not even a play like, r- r- right now. He's he's, good. he's not that good, but yeah, like top five he, though is a pretty big, you know. He, like, he's yeah. not that good, I, but like it's just due to like he he got like nineteenth in like 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 I'm saying oh, he's on trajectory to be better than Luan. Yeah, he keeps on improving. Well. I, I think, think, I think it's like, gonna oh, be a while. It's hard. Yeah, I mean, I mean, but it, it depends because it, obviously it's it's a lot easier to like jet up to like top 20 or whatever yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and then like and stall. a lot of people do that <laughs> yeah a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of people do a lot of people do that and they stall for a while right but, yeah it's the next and, person that's like one of you guys or it's like oh shit they beat like me or prof or, yeah, that, or one that, of the that, established people that, you know? that, yeah. that, that'll probably be Luan or Jamie yeah, yeah oh Jamie, Jamie actually if Jamie could attend stuff he's 100% my, my top it, 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 I, 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 I think I think I'd still I, I, I'd, 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 even with both of them I'd still have Luan I think can you, can you, you know you know more about uh, Jamie what do you think um I don't think it's either of them to be honest I would say Modest wait <laughs> really you can't see can you call Modest no, Major an up and cover <laughs> no, but to be fair, he, he took a long break. I, 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 I think he could still be in that in that uh, like, section. I, I know he took a break, but then he took a break when he was like, like kind of like um, mid mid level ish. And then when he was on that break, when he stopped playing, he got a lot better. Even when he wasn't like attending, he's good. But school. like, I think he's got like a lot of like issues when it comes to attendance. Like, yeah, yeah. 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 Stuff, so. I, I think true skill. He's better than both of them. Interesting. Yeah, okay. Uh, I know, uh, I'm seeing that question as like in the next year or two, like who's going to be up there with those guys, right? Yeah, I would say probably Luan, but yeah. uh, my bet's on Luan, but we'll see, we'll see. Okay, I mean, yeah, we'll move on. mostly because he's a box player. Yeah, but I, I think being a box <laughs> player, like, still is a pretty big. Mine would, be on, mine would be on Luan over Jamie, mostly just because of the UK spread. Like I think mine's because Jamie's a child. Every- yeah. <laughs> You can't get any tournaments. I think everyone in this call would be like a hard roadblock for Jamie. Yeah. Yeah, potentially. I can see him cheesing me. But... <laughs> 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 That's like every up and coming player. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, got like three back, three back to back three O's, and he's like, yeah, I could get cheeser. <laughs> hmm. Close three O's though. Okay. All right. Um. So next one, who's winning the next Arcadian? Yeah, this, I didn't know who could enter the. Who yeah, could, I, which, I, the hard thing is we don't know the eligibility. Wait, can you? Can you? Can you? Can you okay. Yeah, you can. I think it is going to be one of Ant or Tanky. Good shout. One of those two. Uh, Ant, Tanky, maybe Vidant. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Those are probably the best bets. Uh, 
and Tanky Verdun, you know, mm-hmm. it, it completely depends on the matchups so they really get. Yeah. Like, I don't know. But, yeah. I think it'll probably. Mm. There's like some little Irish kid who's pretty good, but I'm not sure if he'll come. I think it's just down to how the. I, I think Euro is pretty much the favourite, but it might. But I think it comes down to how he does versus Dan, which I, I have no I, idea. I'd, I'd favour uh, I'd favour Ant over Euro. I think Euro is the uh, every set I see Euro played. It's always ultra close for the most yeah, random. Yeah. <laughs> you, you say it to him every single tournament. It's always like two one last start, and he's he's either like super salty because he lost or like super sweating and popping off because he like <laughs> won like, the most intense set ever <laughs> what's the tag of the irish guy i know who you're on about yeah yeah wait what did he say frog chip yeah frog chip frog chip yeah he's like yeah that, okay. saying frog chip silo very hard yeah but, but, is, frog chip, but guys, win, is, is he arcane winning material no he's he's actually pretty good yeah, yeah but arcane no i i think he'd probably lose the tanky so it'll depend yeah. a bit yeah definitely uh, i think tanky i think tanky beat this just on oh wait from chip has beaten sharp nice no for, 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 from chip's good nice yeah I never but you know even, even good people like the theory is you have to be as good as prof to not get cheesed by tanky if you play fox <laughs> Like that. <laughs> Wait, what? That, 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 that's a theory. If you're not as good as Prof, you will get cheesed by Tanky if you're a Prof player. <laughs> at least once in your life. As to, I guess twenty as twenty feet lost to Tanky loads. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that's very <where it laughs> so, <comes> so, <laughs> Tank Tanky's beaten Strange and twenty three loads, and they're currently yeah. sixth and seventh on the rankings. So. Yeah. I hear that. I hear that. Yeah, but yeah, but yeah I'd say you were and Tanky, that frog chip guy. Oh, what? what? Oh, Paphos, pretty good. Okay. I, I'm player. still, but if we're talking about like someone who's gonna win it, like, yeah, no, I, I, actually just the best, like the person to win it. I still have I, to between you and Verden. I think I, I would say Ant. Oh, you still think Ant? Yeah. To win it, okay, okay. I'd say Ant. What about you guys? Do you know? Do you know much about uh, these players? Well, I know you know you are Elliot, but yeah, I think <laughs> I think, I think Euro or Verden. Yeah, I think those are all very safe picks. I'm gonna throw out a sleeper, Midori. <laughs> for winning the whole event yeah okay 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 I'm gonna say I think this is the least stacked this is the least stacked Arcadian I think we've ever had <laughs> yeah, because the, the, everyone's starting to move into the PR that's why yeah. this, it's getting it's getting hard yeah, AC would, yeah, someone said AC AC, <laughs> AC <laughs> did beat AC did beat King Goose Fox to be fair I heard, I heard the legend I heard the he legend he's never been more pissed at a set in my life yeah, <laughs> did you get forward beat did you get side beat he just didn't stop yeah, <laughs> you gotta learn. I felt, I, felt, I felt like actively offended. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. I, I, it, it seems like it, that's how, just how he plays. He played that that for years. Ever since I met him, like from like nine, eight years ago, whenever like he was doing that since then, and he's never changed. So I think that's there's a cool. fair. Yeah, I think there's a fair like group of five or six who could mm. all easily win it. To be honest, yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe. I don't think so. I don't. I think five six might be a big too big too big of a pool, but maybe maybe I'm underestimating some of the players. Nah, yeah, I think you. I think you're. I mean, I don't think you're. I think you're overestimating some of the players. Okay, okay. I'll take that. Yeah. I'll take that for now. Yeah. I think we are at the last question. I mean, I think King, you had one about describing the different puffs. So if you oh, want to yeah, do that, yeah, you yeah. Can describing the different puffs. Like, yeah, Jules like wanted to difference. ask what's the play style differences between the puffs in the UK. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> um, I think I'm the best. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> um, think I haven't seen Jim. I think George is cheesy. Um, I think Jamie does a lot of kill moves, and that makes him really scary. Um, can, we can, we scu- can we get a free scut? Can we get a free and uh, thingy? Ray said Scux. Scux is... I don't know. Yeah. I haven't played him. I'm not allowed to talk about that because they paid us 20 quid not to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so, um, Jamie throws out a lot of kill moves. That makes him scary. A lot of people choke to it. If you run away enough, I think he starts to struggle. So I think camping him struggles. I think I'm better into campy players. But he can beat someone who gets annoyed at Puff easier. Um... That question, I'm going to be honest with you. I think I said it in this chat. 
that question actually did annoy me because George said, uh, I feel like Puff players get kind of homogenized when people talk about their play styles. And I remember yeah. looking at, what was it? It was like Moki's cool or flow chart here list. <laughs> yeah. And it was like complete shit. None of the Fox <laughs> players got spoken about properly. <laughs> it's like, all, if you're a fast fox, everyone's like, cool, pipe, aggro. If you're a slow fox, they're like, lame, campy, cringe. I think all the yeah. puffs play the same. With <laughs> I remember, I, I've never been more angry yeah. than yeah. watching Frenzy vs. Aura at Smash World Tour, <laughs> and Chillin' Dude describes Frenzy as a pretty aggressive Falco. Oh, yeah, man, it's true. Yeah, yeah. That's what my mum yeah, always yeah. says. She's yeah. like, oh, the commentators are saying you're really aggressive and you have fire. And I was like, yep, that's me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 think, I, like... think, I think the difference between the puffs are like, I think Jamie has more rare setups than King Yu. And I think George is known, I think George is known for their bad habits, and that's literally it. But... I can't like whether this Jamie has better rest setups propaganda. No, no, I, 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 I didn't even say better rest setups. I just said more. No, think, I've not seen them. Am I just I, not I, being hit? By I, them? Yeah, I don't think I'm being hit by them. I'm telling, uh, I'm telling Jamie finds like the jammiest rests of all time. Like, it's I swear, you lot actually just like tech in consistently. No, he, and that's he, why you're getting rest He'll There's like no... do, he'll do like drift forward up air and stuff like. He, oh, oh, he, okay, right. yeah. He he, fi- he finds up to he finds up tilts actually. I've seen him. Do, he does like weird like wave dash out shields up till. Yeah, yeah, but like he, he like does the amount of movement. Kind of you don't really do that. What I does that mean? I think he's so, like. I think he's better. I think he like converts off his movement reads more with rests. If that makes sense. Doesn't. Yeah, you're not really getting it. No, it, it's making sense in my head. Yeah. I'm thinking back to all the times I've been resting. Move on. What's okay. the weird? Is there another question? Right, there is a final yeah, question. Which question. is a question weird one, but yeah. what, is what is it? It is. Um, what's the last book you finished, and did you enjoy it? Oh, actually, I actually have a good answer to this. I don't even know what you guys would have read. <laughs> I'm not gonna the lie. Last, the last book yeah. I read was Play Optimal Poker by Andrew Brokos. <laughs> It's like a poker coaching book mm. that uh, Tarot recommended me. It was very good. I learned a lot, and it improved my game quite a fair bit. So, yeah, it was, it was a good book. Good recommendations. Yeah, and I, yeah, I read, you, you I guys read, read Flowers in the Attic by VC Andrews. I thought it was a pretty good book. Yeah. <laughs> Did you read? Are you too old for reading? No, I, re- I, I read Ki- uh, King Killer Chronicles. It's like a. Uh, it's like a uh, fantasy book, and it was amazing. Oh, so it was actually really fucking good. So. Nice. I didn't know you were one of those Game of Thrones people. Fair I enough. love fantasy. I, I love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this, is, this is why I love One Piece because I love I love anything to do with like world building or anything. Uh, yeah, it is, it is the one that Alex and Silas read, by the way, Booba. But yeah, it's a. Uh, I read it, and it was. I think it was amazing in it. So. Uh, all right, mine was a uh, deep work, which is like a. Uh psychology self-improvement book whatever by uh, Cal Newport and I thought it was pretty good um, definitely recommend it if you want to learn about that sort of thing you're one of those guys that like, you read the constant like you know those psychological like how to manipulate people and make no no, no no it's not like that it's like um, <laughs> it's like uh, what's it called it's like dealing with uh, like distractions and stuff like that. And next time you're in the room like you know the, the main tip for how to make friends with influential people you're supposed to say their name a bunch like, like, I, that. I have heard yeah, that. Yeah, like, like, yeah. I hate that stuff. It feels performative. I hate it. No, it's, yeah, it's yeah, not. I, like that. It's I, not like I, that. I, I, think, I think that's yeah. the point. That's the. It's supposed to be performative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, supposed I just. To... I'm not. I'm not a big fan of. Uh, I'm just gonna start calling you Aaron a bunch next time I see mm. you. Like, <laughs> Max, how are you doing? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. You're, supposed, you're, you're supposed to ask for lots of favors as well, because yeah. apparently that's like a relationship building tool. Like, yeah, Interesting. Things. I uh, I've yeah. got one more question, um, yeah, go for it. which I think we are, I think it more so applies to like me and Max than it does YouTube. But it can That's fine. Right. Like, it's your stream. It's your... Um, who outside of the PR do you think gives you the most difficult time in tournament sets? And you know why is that? Are you talking about uh, outside of that... like the top PR or like just? PR I feel something? like that could just be reworded to like who's the who's like someone significantly worse than you who gives you like quite a difficult time. Uh, got it. Uh, uh, blank. I think the answers for me is Medena pretty easily. Uh, mm. uh, I mean, maybe Nightstar apparently. 
<laughs> if I, I mean, this is all a question for me. If I have no sleep, that's that's the question. So that's if I go, <laughs> if I if I go to a tournament on next to no sleep, I think I could potentially lose to a combo of Luan twenty three. Yeah, but they're ranked. They're stranger. Yeah, yeah, I say yeah, no, like, it has to be someone like. If I mean, I, I just thought we were talking way worse than me. They don't, I wouldn't say Luan's way worse than you. But I, even even on a good day, I wouldn't say Luan's right. way worse than okay, you. Okay, fair, fair enough, fair enough. Oh, that, that's, that's up to interpretation. <laughs> okay, okay. Right, okay but, I'll, I'll let the chat decide. Right, say, I'm, like talking about, I'm like talking about Nightstar here. Right, 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 right. Okay, 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 okay. The, the next okay. top five is significantly worse okay. than you. Okay, well, is Bomboni, is Bomboni worse enough? I, 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 I think it's got to be minimum like twentieth or something. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well. But, okay. Well. I. 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 I'd, I'd say like literally out of everyone like who's ranked near Bomboni like R twenty three like these people ranked above Bomboni like R twenty three GG Archie Omid and Squeechu who are all ranked above Bomboni. I'd say out of all those, I'd still think Bomboni would give me the hardest. Okay. Okay. That's a fair. So I. I. I think that's my actual fair answer. Yeah. Yeah, because I, I saw this question and I was trying to answer it and I'm like, I, I kind of just destroyed it. I think I was talking, yeah, yeah, I, I, I'm going to be like, like, like uh, I, I, like, I can't answer it, this it, it might be a chic thing, but like, I really don't, like, I feel like there's nobody I'm really too worried about who's not like pretty highly bright. I mean, even the people highly ranked, so I'm only really too worried when I'm like that tired. Does anyone so, want to answer Bubar's question? He was answering that out too. I'm ignoring it on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> like Barry Burns comes along once every thousand years. How many years does it take for each of us to come along? Yeah, each of you uh, to come along. I don't know. I, don't know. <laughs> I think anyone like us can come along if you put the work in. Yeah. And you can by going to metafy.gg or slash metafy. self Yeah. self Yeah, I think we'll be helping her. All right. I think... Yeah, uh, I think we can wrap up then, right? We got yeah, all the yeah. Questions. Thank you for everyone who actually donated. If you want to do any yeah. little uh, oh, yeah. end, of, end of donation, uh, you know, little throw-ins uh, here. Yeah, where did you get up to at the readouts, Aaron? With the readouts? Yeah, yeah. with like. The yeah, I, read, I think I read it. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah, I can read. I think I read all of that. Your donation from Brandon Speed saying money match me at quarter prof five pounds. <laughs> we can do wow. that. We can do that. All right, prof. Let's uh, say modest, ma- <laughs> modest major. So modest the maker supporting the fan donated fifty pounds. Thank you, thank you. And who loves the donated donated twenty five pounds? Go get on boys. My American brothers and sisters need some humbling. Not that Europe is still home, but some of the best melody you can find. <laughs> yeah. It's true. Oh, yeah, we, will so do, we will do. We raised like over four hundred quid this stream. That's very good. Yeah, thank nice. You. Thank thing. you, everyone. I think we're we're past the halfway point now. We're at fifty five percent of yeah, the uh, yeah. two thousand yeah. pound goal. Um, so thank you, everybody, who supported over the stuff. last two streams. Yeah, I'm, uh, yeah. Like- Wait, wait, before we go, what, what, what's, the, what's the next thing we're doing to help? Because obviously we're halfway now, so we yeah. have to do something else. What's the next thing we're actually well, doing? To I spoke to so earlier about like, maybe going around to his place at some yeah, point. Yeah, yeah. Like, I was thinking doing, before like, Gommel, I think that would be good. Do, like do, a final. Do, yeah, doing like an in real life, but we, we should probably do something in between now and then. Wait, wait, wait. When? Do you, what, what kind of date? I, I miss like, it. Like, before Gommel in June. Yeah, Sometime. but that, that's, that's kind of far. We need yeah. Something. yeah, because we, we we need to like obviously we need to book flights, so it'll be preferably if we get it if done. You... Soon. <laughs> like, obviously not too soon, but we we definitely need like a like some uh, basement. Yeah, I mean, if anybody has ideas, charity tournaments, somebody said. That's yeah, we, a good idea. We, yeah, maybe we could. We just want we, to do something wait, to help. We're like host a tournament where the entry fee goes towards our GoFundMe. We could do that. We could do that. We could. It sounds kind of. I mean, actually, I, I guess we could do that. We could give like a pro, like a non money prize, but which is yeah. still worth it. Let's vacation. <laughs> I, I, I said worth it. <laughs> 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 what are you wow. thinking? Yeah, thanks so much, to everyone. You actually a tournament doing you could right. commentate, and the money goes to it. Sounds like a good idea. Yeah, we'll, well, I think what we'll do is we'll make like a Twitter like thread about it, and people can post their suggestions there. Wait. Stylo actually just did fifty pound. Uh, said Kingu winning Gomo. No, thank you so much. Oh. <laughs> <Thank> <laughs> you, Stylo. Thank you. Appreciate it. I think that's Stylo's second donation. Yeah, I was gonna say. He did oh, not really? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Very, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> very, very kind of him. All right, thank you. Oh, that's an Arcadian winner right there. <laughs> <laughs> you ready? I think that's yeah, sweet. That, is that yeah, it? let is me that uh, it? yeah, let me find yeah. out who we can raid. Uh, in the meantime, if you guys have got any shout outs, you can do them. No, I just uh, yeah, I just hope that we actually just raise the money. Obviously, we both for your first time in America or in Canada, 
and uh, we'll, yeah. we'll, we'll have a good time. We'll just get Airbnb, go hotel, whatever, and yeah, it yeah. should be should be a good be trip good. to be honest. We should put that soon. Yeah. There's already about nine of us on the same flight going up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The UK is already going kind yeah, of deep. There are like nine of us on the same flight, and there are like four people on a different flight. Already. Yeah, so, so UK's deep already in there. So who are uh, everyone? There's uh, a de- we have a we have a chat. If anyone in this chat is from the UK and and is interested in going, we actually have. I can a, probably I can you, Chief. We could just invite uh, you. Sh- sh- uh, yeah. I could just send a link in the chat for this Discord. To be honest. Yeah, yeah, I don't care. Yeah, yeah, if you're yeah. from the UK, but yeah, if if you're, if you're from the UK and, you're, and you want to come join that Discord, you can, you can come with we us. We have like travel plans, and yeah, we're already. There's, I think I think it's like. Uh, Nebs is going, Sean, Tenkut, Shrees is going, uh, Omid, me, Silas. Elliot, Silas, Alex, me. Yeah, me. Nah, I think, I think Silas and Elias had to drop, sadly. But... Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Everyone else is coming. Yeah, I mean, yeah. you can see in the Discord who's going. Like, Max, good, well, yeah, you can just see everyone who's going. There's, yeah. a, there's a whole bunch of people that are, that are going. And, uh, yeah, so, should be a good one. I don't think that flying. I don't think you're not flying from Bristol. Are no, you? I'm flying from London. Yeah, yeah look, uh, yeah. Uh, you, you'll be flying from London, Chief. Yeah, very, very likely. If you want to talk about it, I'm down. Um, yeah. All right, awesome. But, um, yeah. I think that's the end of the stream. I'm gonna raid Coder, and since you raided me the other day, so right, yep. Yeah, thank everyone right. for watching. This will be uploaded to YouTube as well. So if you do want to, you know, look back at some of the lists or some of the funny moments, feel yeah. free. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in a bit. Let's see it's it. It's oh, yes. Sweet. Yeah? yeah, it's good. Yeah, yeah I'm just waiting now. Oh, wait, I know who Coder, I know who Coder is. <laughs> it's Nobody nothing, knows. Yeah. That's, that's the map I want to play when I go to Gongles. Yeah. Fun.